but it's accurate about the one time I had it when it had too much cheese and too much lens. Last time cool. on the Terrible. misadventures of research. A few things did happen last session, actually. Um, also, too much hot sauce. Uh, now the Diablo sauce is fucking delicious. Um, right, sure, but there was too much sauces. Nah. There's like 20 bags of sauce, like free tacos. Nah. Uh, you all <clears throat> actually uh, um, helped out a fae. Uh, in the sense, you protected the forest in the sense that it was protecting uh, by uh, a small group of uh, brigands. Um, <laughs> Cunts. Uh, assholes. Um, People that been going around, you know, killing Faye, doing what they do. Uh, they uh, were taken out very fairly easily, uh, with the combined efforts of everyone. Uh, turns out, uh, one one fireball does a lot. Uh, wasn't it two? Uh, yeah, the second one was literally just for one guy, though. Yeah, one spellcaster, because fuck him. Yeah, fuck that one guy in particular. Um, but, uh, after dealing with them, you actually ended up taking one of them prisoner, uh, learning that they were hired, uh, to do this. After failed torture attempts, uh, the guy actually eating the leg of one of his friends... You assume his friends, and uh, a lot, and I mean a lot of suggestions being cast on this guy. None of them working. None of them working. Pretty fucking funny. Uh, you all have more or less made your way back to uh, Bronzeguard. Uh, meeting back with Joan. And the sizable retinue that she was left with. Uh, and also making a deal with uh, Doran. Uh, on uh, making a good little bit of money. And also making your ways up north. So, uh, to his uh, thought, uh, you all are taking by boat. Because quick and safe, surprisingly. Sure. It's, like, it's like traveling in the forest where people can attack you instead of traveling on the river where only a few people can attack you. Uh, because and those of... people being more powerful because they're, they can attack one person. Eh. <laughs> a lot easier. A lot easier. A lot less stays. Well, that's pretty much it. Uh, you all, after reaching Bronzecard, also, <laughs> more or less, uh, mm. started to make your way towards Camera, where there is a cleric that can, at least you, I've heard that there's a cleric there, that can assist in making your prisoner speak the truth. Though getting them to speak will be a different challenge. That's great, we have a soul strip for that, right? Yeah, I'll just cast Suggestion uh, 20 more times and maybe it'll work once. Does anyone have Bane? I do. Use that first. Can I try to go with Tog? He doesn't speak common. Oh, okay. He only speaks like Sylvan. Wow. It's like he's from a country where Sylvan is the common language. No. Weird. What 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 country would that be? Slee, if I remember correctly. Oh, I would hope. Uh, I don't have my notes nah. with me. They're over there. <laughs> would would Melamir know? Uh, of the country of Slee. I mean, I. That's a given, but like language? No, you would not know. You you already have the languages that your character knows. Oh. 
this can no, that be as as Sylvan? I feel like someone's retroactively going through his character being like, should I change my languages now? Because my character hasn't been introduced yet. Uh, no. Oh, no. Be. I already had Sylvan. <laughs> that was the first language I took. Hey. Also, hey, more who is... Who is... Ta who is... Torin? Oh, yeah. they in were they, were they, were they so, introduced uh, yet? Yeah, yes. they're introduced. We're in the tavern right now. Oh, they, okay. they were introduced last week. When we were fighting. Okay. What? 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 What we know about about the fairy person? Uh, you they're know. a fairy person. They're a fairy person. Yeah. Uh, they're friendly. Yeah, but they're a dragon. They're they're a fairy dragonborn. What? Those wings don't work. Just let that concept sink in. If you know anything about fairy dragons. I don't. <laughs> They're as, uh, as big as a pixie. So incredibly small. Yep. This one uh, is and equally mysterious. This one <laughs> is a sign of a, of a dragon ball. Of a, of a, of a, of a what? A dragon, dragon ball. Born. A normal dragon ball. How big are they? <laughs> Normal, normal size. Size. How do you fucking check my height? Oh. Just Actual oh. people size. Either way, you're four times the size of a normal fucking what you're Fixed. supposed to be. I'm six ten. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh fuck. Tall. I think you're the tallest oh, actually, no? <laughs> how many how many six two? How one how one how wouldn't that be <laughs> Whatever. I'm gonna have to crank my fucking neck to talk to people. Jesus Christ. Yeah. yeah. She chose a poor size for your character, like a loser. Character's only five four. Yeah, but you like him small. Yes. Wait, all, all your characters are always below, like five six. I mean, they're, either they're really, either they're really short or really tall. That's really yeah, that's true. So whenever they're really tall, they're normally a small race. So yeah, to be and normally true. they're smaller than they are now. Usually they're like four foot or less. Because they're cold. So, oh God. Or a weird fairy creature. But yeah. yeah, so what were we calling you? Bocco. Bocco, yeah. Because imagine giving out your real name. Yeah, like you would do that. Like normal people. So you are also, you know, you're not a fae. So it doesn't really matter that much. But. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah. Also. Could you in Discord put your character name in like brackets or something so we can easily see it? Well, like uh, as a nickname on this. Server. Yeah. So it'd just be on the server. Don't change your actual name because no one would do no. that. <laughs> Looks at self. <laughs> I did that at the very beginning of me using fucking Discord, so yeah. So what's your original name? Uh, I think like King Cat something. It's my King email. Cat. King Cat, yeah. Oh, King Cat. Yeah. Okay. I prefer Lord Rinshaw. <laughs> so, thanks. So, it may be because I've right. used it for so long. King King Cat's better. Oh. No. <laughs> call him Ren because that's what I used to call him. Well, yeah, that's his name. So, hundred percent. So yeah, at the tavern, we'd have gone through the whole name thing, which he probably would have been there for. So, Gag, you would know this person as Michael. Baka? Book. 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 Baka. 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 
They are bitch. pink, fey, and very obvious. Well, green, also. Right. Most ten percent green, but sure. Look at my characters that I completely forgot. They're not 10% green. 0.20. Fucking who cares about percentage? Can't do it. I can't believe you mentioned a percentage. <laughs> <laughs> fucking square up. <laughs> I'm still looking at those fucking feet. <sighs> I don't know how. I. I, like... <laughs> I think. It's like you're rooted all the time. <laughs> Yes. The way the trees do. I am one with the trees. Back the bibbity bobbity up. <laughs> Before I take your fucking knees. I'm not that short. And also, you're too tall to take people's knees. Ridiculous. <clears throat> wow, it's so fucking unrealistic. <laughs> My immersion. <laughs> so, yeah, Gag, you know them. Blah, 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 moving on. Okay. You can talk to them if you want. It's crazy. It, you are in wow. a safe place. Crazy. We're in Bronze Guards. We're with... Uh, what's her face? Joan. Joan. Yeah, that one. Black, the blacksmith lady? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we've just got back. <laughs> and we're... Just discussing what happened, but not really. Lolo is also still here. Going yes. Fucking uh, camera. Yeah, they've they've told us that they're going to leave us at camera because that's their home, so they're just going to stay there when we get them. And the blacksmith is continuing with us because originally, apparently, they weren't going to stay at camera. They were going to stop at camera, and then we were going to take them somewhere else. Wasn't fully discussed or understood. <laughs> Because Kurt didn't listen to what people say. I don't think anyone did. So I fault. wasn't there. Yeah. So I, I feel like I feel like Joan's a little annoyed at all this side tracking. Oh, she's all right. She's <laughs> happy to have her. Is the o- like Drick is the only person who was there. Yeah, out of the out of the current. What do you mean? It's fine. Also, there isn't really that much side tracking. It's literally you've actually made your way up. It's just yeah. For the, for she's the been, she's been traveling for half the time we were right anyway, so yeah. She's probably been here for like a day or two. Yep. Ah, uh, okay. So it's not crazy, and it gives her a little break. She she's probably been around here just doing some blacksmithing because it's a mining town. Make it getting some like metals. Yeah. Probably getting some ore and shit just to trade. <laughs> Makes sense. Those are the best places to sell it. Yeah. And so where where are we keeping the the prisoner dude? Uh, he is on the back of. What do I have right now? Snakes. Probably. Uh, yeah, I've got a. a... Yeah. What? Crust- what giant crustacean or reptile? Oh yeah, um, Beth. Uh, Beth, Beth. Currently, Bess is carrying them. Oh yeah, What's you had two Besses. No, 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 uh, two Besses was when we were in New Crescent, New Crest. Mm. I need one Bess. So. Oh, who's, what's a Bess? Bess is the giant <laughs> crab who talks. <laughs> we have crustacean <laughs> talking crabs. Yeah, a giant <laughs> crab the size of a person. Yeah. That's why they're carrying them, because they're fucking huge. huge they only angry. broke his arm once. No, they didn't break his arm. Broke his ankle. They did? Oh yeah, yeah, who cares? I don't. I'll remember these small details, but it doesn't matter. Someone, someone broke the crab's ankle? No. The dude, no, the crab the broke crab, the dude's ankle. Yeah. Oh. Because it was clamping was gonna... down a bit too hard. I was yeah. gonna say, like, do crabs even have ankles? <laughs> yeah, they have loads of them. <laughs> we have human ankles. Yeah, one, one in each hand. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I just left the restoration date, it was fine. 
Uh, so yeah, let's go. Don't know if anyone wants to do anything here, we'll just go. Yeah, I got nothing. I, mean, I, don't, I don't see a reason why we should stay. Yeah, let's just leave. Okay. Uh, we've got to wait until the guy wants to be escorted. What? What? Um, because aren't we getting paid to take a guy somewhere? Are you a part of that deal? Yeah. Yeah, she's getting paid. I wasn't sure if she was... Because I thought she was just joining us for this faith thing. I am, and then I fucking got roped into it as well, I think. Did you? I don't know. Well, if you want to make money, I'll happily let you in. Yeah, no, oh, I'm just clarifying. Uh, if you want to join, it's fine. I just clarifying. Think of all the no, friends you'll make, all the people you'll kill. Oh yeah, also Malamar wasn't part of the deal, so if you want to join Malamar, you can as well. What do you mean? I was the first one who met him. I was the first right. one who, but like... You but you weren't currently conscious when the deal was made. You were tea oh my god. So... No, I, I'm part of the deal, because I was the first one who actually met the damn dude. Right, but you weren't conscious to say yes at the time, so do you want to be part of the deal? The oh my question. god, I'm no, I'm part of the deal. Okay. It's a yes or no question, it's not. I think they already said yes. They haven't said yes, actually. Yeah. Okay, okay, I'll say yes. I'll say yes then. I'm part of the okay, deal. There we go, you're in the deal. <laughs> 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 <All right>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, classic Kurt. <laughs> 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 can we can we leave this fucking tavern there? Oh, you hate that, just be honest. <laughs> Make life a little bit harder for everyone. A little bit easier for a lot. That's a couple of really. Oh. So, whisper to Clarence. You don't really care. Well, you all stay here. I'll get the horses, <laughs> yes? Yes. I can help. Alright. You'll see as also him and uh, Galrath will be going with him. Because Galrath will be getting horses for his people. I already have horses for him. They don't have what? horses. They don't own them. Galrath. What about Yowie? Yeah. Galrath no. is the Eladrin. Oh, okay, pretty boy. The fairy got it. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Pretty boy that Thanks. summoned fairy to deliver messages. Yeah. Well, I, I do know love. What the going on. I do love the fairy is in a receptionist. I do have to say. Top tier. Um, but uh, making your ways to the stable uh it goes on pretty easily uh you would learn that dorn is renting until the party reaches off the tail oh, yeah, to the river and galrath will be renting till camera because that's when you all should get all the information and he can make his way back Yep. And a sizable amount of horses are wrangled and are given to the group. Horse. Uh, a lot of galleries. People are doubling up. <laughs> yes, I'll go ahead. As always. So. Do ranger things. Alright. So you scout the road ahead. Uh, Am I on a horse? Or... Uh, Can you scout a horse? But you can can run off this time too? But you can't do the horse? thing. You cannot scout with horse to my knowledge. <laughs> so you would not really be able to scout because the horses travel faster than you do. They're like twice your speed. Who'd have to like leave an hour early? They'd still catch up. Yeah, well, it would be an hour ahead of us, and then 
don't catch up, then you'll just be with us anyway. So. <laughs> don't worry. No matter I mean, what. I thought the horse. I thought the horse would be more like walk longer without getting tired, not really going. Um, no, they they, they go at like fast. sixty sixty feet. Horses are just faster. Yeah, okay, just... I'll, I'll just stay with I'll just stay with the group then on my horse. Well, you can just keep, you, keep an eye on that because you still got good peeping eyes, right? Uh, I guess. And I got good teenage boy has good peeping yeah. eyes. Yes. You got good perception, right? Yeah, I have eighteen. Yeah. <laughs> you have eighteen perception. Uh, pass. Wait. Oh, pass. Uh, yeah, yeah, pass. Plus that. Yeah, plus that. Yes, still very good. <laughs> For a plebeian. Yeah, still very good. Yeah. For a plebeian. <laughs> <laughs> what are your guys' passive perceptions? Twenty. Twenty-one. Eleven. Oh. I the stages characters always have trash perception. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. Yeah, because I never play wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> Nor do I. <laughs> Doesn't stop me. <sighs> okay. Yeah. I think Borovic had really good perception. <laughs> Borovic oh, yeah. Lead close to 30. Yeah, but that was one of like your first characters for Friends games, which was yep. funny. No, the the first. Mm. No, the second. The second. First. Well, the you made, no, it was the paladin. They made the paladin that you got bored of and was like, oh yeah, he's gonna go off and do something. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, he, no, he left because he couldn't stand you people. <laughs> nah, that's that's also understandable. <laughs> what are you talking about? It was great. He was a great I, I have made a paladin leave of the campaign. So... Yeah. Well, yeah, because paladins are trash. Common knowledge. <laughs> No, just he couldn't handle my bullshit. <laughs> oh well, I wonder why. I mean, I did sort of kill his character almost. No, I would never do that. Oh no, not in front of the <laughs> off. Especially, I would, I would never kill his character. I, I, I didn't leave character. the campaign to just switch characters because you know his character left, which makes more sense because <sighs> you fit the group. With the group, it's crazy. Ah, uh, the memories. Yes, yeah, sweet, sweet memories of my bullshit to character. That's great. I would still the love to do a one shot. Fighter man. I would oh. still love to be able to do a one shot with those characters at one point. <laughs> Everyone meeting up. It'd just be RP. <laughs> but that's pretty. Yes. Truthfully, because it'd be everyone meeting up again, so Morvin would. We could give, uh, we could have a, like um uh, uh, a a meeting like um a reunion. A family. Gathering. And then we get attacked. And then we get attacked by something. No one's something going to attack. Uh, I can tell you that much because it'd be in the Forgotten Realms, and people don't fuck with what you all deal with. <laughs> Yeah, but I want something to attack though, because it's funny. I know you want something to attack, but nothing <laughs> in their right mind would. <laughs> I feel like something would, and it would be broken. <clears throat> As in, it'd be broken, or it, it would be broken, or get broken it, real fast. Yeah. All, of the, all of the above. Because the Eldrazi doesn't exist in the Forgotten Realms. At least not yet. It could. Match the Gathering shit hasn't been blended through completely. Pools pool exist. It's true. But there's more. More is more. Magic the Gathering is coming to D and D. Yeah. Well, D and D's coming to Magic the Gathering. <laughs> the thing is, it'd be great if the new books would hurry up and get out because one of them, or both of them, would be very good for this campaign. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, the the, uh, the fucking Fey one. Yeah. All the, fa- the, the Fey shit. shit. I think they're both Fey. The new ones. Yeah. Well, I think one of them's like the campaign. Yeah. Yeah. It's like the uh, the vampire one. Anywho. But for Fey, I think. Vampire. <laughs> they still need to do a DMG type thing, an update of DMG. With actual rules, that useful. No, but... they do that. They just make more books. Yeah, they, they, make, they make player books. They make DM books. 
Anyway. So. I would I trample him. Trample. Do you like me to roll the dice? I don't know. Are you quick enough? Uh, well, I didn't know if you wanted me to roll the dice. Of course he does. It's not even a question. Yeah, I do. <laughs> We not on water. That means then it'd be a D one hundred. Exactly. <laughs> All right. So as the party makes their way through the, uh, entering into the forest as you all did once before, uh, sticking to the mountain road this time. Uh, it's different. Uh, about halfway through the journey, about maybe an hour after you entered into uh, a sizable amount of flowers uh, would enter your view. Uh, they would be of sunflowers, tulips, roses, just scattered amongst. I thought we were going to get mugged again. We still might. This time. Uh, flowers are gonna come up with a knife. Oh, watch out, honey. Hand, hand over hand over the pollen, bud. I just flick another flower, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. They, just, they talk like Italian gangsters. Bippity boppity spaghetti. Um yeah. The way the Italian do. <laughs> Am I seeing anything weird about this place? Uh, for those, actually, let me double check. Uh, My druid eyes. And yeah, Drick. Both of you make uh, nature tricks. Using my wisdom, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Them flowers be. I'm so lucky. Flowers. <laughs> I can't remember what these flowers are called. Bucko. Bucko? Clown. Oh, she's asleep again. Oh my god. <laughs> Roll nature. Bucko. Mm -hmm. Nature. Clown. Okay. Nature. We're gonna call you Bucko. Yeah, we will. I will call you Bucko. Bucko? Top tier. <laughs> oh yes, we're just gonna each other. So good. <laughs> Definitely the same. Hundred uh, percent. Bucko. <laughs> uh, as you make your way, uh, both of you just see these flowers. They're like, oh yeah, them them some flowers. They pretty. Yeah. Uh, as. I feel like there's a good reason why I don't want that one though, but you know. Oh, the flowers. Ben might, ben might remember, but he won't. Uh, making your way, actually, yeah, uh, that's a good yep. one. Uh, yeah, just passing through the flowers at this point, because they're along the roadside. Uh, people with passive receptions above a 15. So everyone but Sage. Uh, a lot of the guards in Joan um, uh, notice uh, the flowers, the the heads of the flowers just slowly turn as the party passes by. Oh, so it's like they're like sunflowers, got it? And we are their sun. Makes sense. That don't sound right. Yeah. Now, <coughs> seeing that, I will allow one more nature roll, Drake and Bucko, but with disadvantage. So let's see. Oh, ten. Improvement. <laughs> oh, yeah. So? Wow. Eighteen. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, <laughs> the eighteen tells you a whole lot. Because you remember in your time in the Feywild, Bucko. 
flower success. These flowers, they don't look normal. Like with a steady eye, you start to pick out small details about them. That oh, they do look like a tulip, but that ain't a tulip. The leaf difference is what it is. Literally, it's the minor detail of that. Along with each of the flowers that resemble a different type, the leaves are what give it away. These are a type of a flower that resembles the fly trap. Ah, uh, so I should do plant growth here for an hour. But not fly traps. They're more man eaters. Uh. <laughs> Sweet. So I should stay here for eight hours and do plant growth. Got it. You could make all of these flowers a bit more of a problem. <laughs> For an entire year. Yeah. Uh, as you do also, uh, everyone with that passive 15, as the party gets a bit further away from them, they start to grow, and part of the stems start to break off to create something of a, a leafy hand. Their hands, as these plants are growing. Right, they have to go up to back the fuck up before I throw hands. Do you yell that to the flowers? I'm gonna fucking say that and sell them to the flowers. Uh, pretty much every elf, full blood elf in the party, <laughs> just turns to you. <laughs> Enderic, as you just yell, that. I don't hear anything. You would, you would hear what. Oh, yeah, I heard what you said. Yeah. Just look, look back at the hazy fairy lady. Yeah, and, and we just turn around, we see this hand of plant. <laughs> well, a lot of plants growing very quickly into humanoid mm. forms. Okay. Oh, that's not good. Probably. As yelling uh... that, just roll. A Can I get another nature? Yeah, no. Now that they're actually forming. Now that, with, now that you've gotten to, I'll say no. It's just something that you just don't remember. Didn't you say, like, roll the thing or something? Uh, yeah, roll a uh, persuasion or intimidation with disadvantage. Disadvantage? Are we gonna get attacked by some fucking flowers? <laughs> <laughs> you more or less have to beat what they're going to roll. Mm. Talk to your rule. You know what? If we say Bippity Boppy back the fuck up with some optimism here. So, um, All right. unfortunate that that was disadvantage, as you said. Still 17. Still a 17. You see, as the plants waver. If a plant could squint, it would be... See, as like some of the sunflowers that grew, that are now like large creatures. You could see some of the seeds just furrow. Their eyes squint. <laughs> as they slowly shrink back down into their normal size. That's what I thought. But the flowers still watch. Thank you. I appreciate it. Well, that, that's someone else's problem. Ugh, this is annoying. So, the sunflowers turned... The flowers turned into... Big flowers? They turned into humanoid-esque <laughs> flowers, yes. Oh, God. <laughs> and then shrank back down. Yes, into their look normal the flower state. <laughs> Looking at the weird ass flowers. The flowers are clean, looking clean. at you. Can we move on? <laughs> We've been moving on, moving on. Yeah, I All time. think because this is likely going to be an issue in general. I might just cast plant growth and then just leave the path for us to leave because it might 
dissuade any other idiots from going in this area. Now, this is the main road. Yeah, that's... Yeah, exactly, that's my point. So if it's overgrown... You want to they... block off the main road. Right, but the main road is currently covered in carnivorous plants. Around this time, Velik would actually speak up, because he would... We could just get rid of them. Yeah... I wasn't sure if that's... It's like, is this my head cannon trying to figure out if I should do that or not? I, I can't really think. Like, do I think that, that would be a good idea as a druid? I mean, they were quite polite. They are carnivorous plants. <laughs> that yeah. They will is... very likely eat people that cannot defend themselves. This is very true. But then there's also the thing of, I got a 10. <laughs> yeah. So I don't know what they are. <laughs> <laughs> so... Well, you know that they're carnivorous plants because they they were looking at you. And oh, okay. They were growing to that point of that's not a normal fucking flower. Uh... <laughs> I just set them on fire. We aren't we in a forest? Yeah, we don't want to burn down a forest. Are you stupid? Yeah. Yeah, you don't well... want to do that. Shit. Well, uh, start a forest fire. <laughs> Especially not in this forest. <laughs> start a forest fire. <laughs> Yo, can I try and... Feel try free and... to do that yourself. Um, yeah, if you want to start a forest fire, you can then leave us. Question. Because I ain't dealing with that. <laughs> I love arson. I may have an answer for your question. I have a little inquiry. Can I try and persuade the flower yours to go on a less walked on path? You could try. That won't be. A... They're still gonna kill people, though. Yes, but it's, at least it's not on the main road. They're still gonna kill people. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, can I... You know, can we just zero, zero kill and be like, can you just go like one person a month rather than three? Like, you know, so it's very, very annoying. What's going on with these plants? <laughs> can we just like leave a sign saying, "Hey, go around." It's they men frog. eating plants up ahead. Danger plant. It's, it's not a frog. Ridiculous. That's what the frog left warning signs himself. Yeah, and then I added more. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, no, we need to do this, actually. But yeah, um, persuasion, right? You could try and, like, persuade it to leave, <clears throat> persuade it to go back. You could do a lot of things. So it would be better if you could persuade them to go back to the Fey world. Oh, they from, yeah, they're from the Fey world, duh. That's how I recognize them. Because they're just going to eat Fey then, and Fey are, well, whatever. They kind of renew each other. Just fuck and fucking slowly turn. It's like when fate eat each other, it's kind of like, eh, you know, because then they just come back eventually anyway. It's something else. Cherry, stop <laughs> it! You gotta stop eating. I feel like fate just in in just in this re reincarnation place. Oh, so... uh, no. kind of. Everything renews into something else. Uh... That's how nature works. So what's going on with these plants? Uh, no, asking, as, asking in character right now. Are they the carnivorous. Man eating plants. Trying to see right. if kill them or let them go or send them home. If you can send them home? Question mark? Yeah, they can go back to the fire, that would be fine. If they could if you could do that, yeah, that'd be good. Otherwise, uh, we're gonna have to get rid of these. Yes, very much. We, sh we shouldn't have let the last bandit go go the last time. To be fair, we should have taken them out. I don't think we should do it this time. So, what are you gonna say to the plants? I... I think it is within everyone's best interest for you to go to a less occupied hunting space. In the fire world. Preferably either on a less walked upon path or 
or or mayhaps um don't mean to be so presumptuous but maybe the uh, <coughs> fate world <coughs> well, go, to the, go to the fate world i say <laughs> plant squint the furrowing of seeds gather um Make a persuasion check, either one. I... Can I, can I assist her? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that would be very appreciated. Assist, now, please. I will say mm. yes. So I roll again? Yes. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! Oh, that's fucking hilarious. That's hilarious. Oh my uh, god. <laughs> but we're getting some plants. The plants look like they don't like your assuming that they're from the Feywild. <laughs> I'm going to incite them to see if they're going to try and attack us right now. That's more, we can attack them. Nah, they're fine. <laughs> they seem pretty chill. Jesus Christ. <laughs> they're even on the game. <laughs> well, I've still got nine, so... Okay, okay. look, apologies for my assumptions. Um... What? Talking to plants, you know, fucking trying to get us out of the situation. But just go to Feywild, Fey Tasty. <laughs> like they are actually pretty good. They're probably tastier than most people. Well, it, you, you see, as a lot of these plants, uh start planting it up uh, okay, as gonna, they start I'm growing. Cast, I'm gonna cast someone by. Now you back the fuck off again. Plant, grow, <laughs> plant, grow. You start doing a plant dance. You fuckers respectfully fuck off. Respectfully. They're doing a plant respect. dance. Can't, you can't hide from the plant dance. Can they respectfully be prepared to not? <laughs> but not now. <laughs> okay, Valak, well, you can throw the fireball. Yeah. How does it seem very cash money just... No, Fireball's fine. Fireball isn't forever burning, it's instant flash. So Fireball is fine. Oh, Fireball, well, Fireball doesn't set fires. Yeah, it doesn't set fires. There's a chance, depending if it's dry or not. As, as the name would imply, Fireball. Uh, I, would assume, uh, I assume fire. they're not dry because they're living plants. Yes, so... Well, also, it is a radius, but the trees here are also not dry. So yeah. it's not, this is a well rained. Uh, so it's, it's, we're doing initiative. I'm fighting the uh, uh, flower people, I guess. What do you want to do? A 22. Uh, Gelrath oh. and his men mm. are more or less going to pull back and protect Joan. Good. Are you doing a map run? Uh, it do. <clears throat> Just for tokens, really. That's all I'm thinking. Uh, you know, I have this one map. <laughs> one minute. <laughs> uh, actually, uh, about fireball, uh, it does actually say that it ignites flammable objects that are not being worn or carried. So it would just set in in, in 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 the spell. It says that. You know, but that's this one. As I said. <laughs> I'll be back in a sec. Plot twist, these uh, plants actually resist fire. <laughs> Fucking weird plants, man. Fear the plant, fear the plant, it's a plant, plant. Oh. Uh, I've seen one of those before. Fear the plant. As a player, I have seen one of those before, in a book. Wow. Oh, a twelve. It is 
Uh, plant, 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 plant. You won't be a <clears throat> closer side. Uh, more or less, Joan and the majority of them. Everyone else is farther along than everyone because they are protecting. Protect John. Protect the prisoner. Also the prisoner. Do we have full health and all that? Yeah, we've had long rests. Quite a few long rests, probably. So, mm -hmm. Okay. Like three or four, I think. I always keep forgetting how to put your thing. Go to the journal, and then you just drag from your name. Ren, I was about to say, that's a giant uh, fucking humanoid plant. Plant? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, Kane. This well. Yeah, Kane's not even here yet. We'll be right here. Well, Kane is... I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> Probably in the next town. <laughs> We should have like four combats before we even get to him. Eh, why, does, why does not? Why does Torn have a name like that, but we don't? Because you didn't do that to your token. Because Rin didn't do that to your token. I feel like, I feel oppressed. Well, you can do it to your own token because you have a token at all. Yeah. Well, now I get to finally find out what everyone is. Wait, really? Yeah, if you go to the, it's the tab in your character sheet. Mm -hmm. uh, Wait, where? In the main character sheet, it's one of the top tabs. Uh, you can then go to the bottom and update tokens. And it should just click tokens, token settings on the token. You can also do that on the token, but then it won't change save for your token unless a ring saves it for your token. I, I I can't do anything about my token on my character sheet. There should be a, a one of the top tabs. Is it in the attributes and abilities? Yeah, attributes. No, ne next you got attributes, macro generator, ex export import overwrite, and that should be token editor. I just see bio character sheet and A and A. Okay, this must be um this is probably a fucking plugin thing that I've got. I thought everyone had that. Oh, oh whatever. It's fine. You can also just go to your clicking your token and click the cog and then you can edit your character, your token. But then we needs to okay it. And That's also fine. even if you set a name into your token, it doesn't put it on the bottom like that as a player. Cause... Yeah, true. I don't know why it doesn't do like, that. That's really weird. Like I have I, my token has my character's name, but it doesn't show up because Rin has to do things with it. Yep. Also, eh? What's happening? Yeah. This fucking dragging is very annoying, though. <laughs> well, I should, as a player, uh, I'm a little scared about this. Why? Because I know what that plant is. At least the art for it. Yeah, I'm sure it's fine. She have a wizard with fireball that Rin's definitely going to let us use. Yeah, he's here. He's in the party. Oh. Right. <clears throat> hey, Gag, you need to reroll your character token into the turn order. This does that. <clears throat> If my memory serves me right, how do I... Fire, fire so, isn't so click your token and then roll your initiative, and then you can just edit it to your original roll. Once you're in the turn order. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely editing that. But you can do it anyway, no matter what, so... Okay. <laughs> do, you, do you think plants are resistant to eating, or being eaten? Um, uh, no. Have you seen a if anything? If anything, they're easier to be eat. So cool. I mean normally that's because they don't move, but Yeah, most plants are made to be eaten. So nature works. 
I wouldn't, I, suggest, I wouldn't suggest trying to eat the big one though. That's uh, well, no, but uh, it, it depends. Well, they're supposed to, they're designed to be eaten by something. It's not always the same thing. So. Talking about this one specifically. I don't see an issue with this guy. He seems cute. <laughs> you know, he's just got a bunch of like skeletons in his belly. What's wrong with that? Oh, don't worry about that. I I do similar things. Just you actually do. You actually kind of do. You have similar things to that thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so these are humanoids, right, Rin? Or, or beasts? Uh, they're plants. So humanoids. Plants. H- humanoids. Plants. <laughs> I don't think they're the things that the big one makes. No. The other things. So y'all looking at the goddamn thing? Stop it. I'll kill you I'm for it. I'm not looking at anything. I'm fucking doing this from memory. Yeah, I think he's just remembering the image. I don't, I don't remember anything specific. I just remember things that it does, and also I don't... Also, looking at the token, it's fairly obvious. What do you mean? Oh, I see. I see. Hit, I see hit points. Oh, on, on us, yeah, yeah. You just you just updated everyone's tokens. Oh, Did you, okay. I assume you saved to all of our character sheets as well. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rinse it. Could I cast a spell before the combat starts? Ah, you're a bastard. Oh wait. So wait, is Velik just gonna be like an NPC for now? Yeah. Uh, he's just gonna he's gonna be that spell. He's gonna, gonna be cast, a. Who's gonna cast spells for them? Yeah. Can you put him in the back as well? Because that's where he would be. Yeah. I'm just uh, trying to hunt down. Yeah. Sadly, they got rid of like the search bar for everything, so you now have to scroll through all what, the, the goddamn options. Um. Question. In the token. Answer. Um. Am I able to do like one free skill check? Per combat, or not per combat, per round? It's an action to do a skill check, technically. Sure. Depending on the skill check, though, yeah, generally it's a free action for some of them, though. I was going to do nature to see if I, if I remember all the other sheds, like, because they look different to the shed. I think that's what your nature check was for originally, right? To figure out what they are. Oh, yeah. So. But, like, they look different, and, like... Yeah, true. But you got what was it? An, an eighteen. Yeah. So, so would Barco know what the big flower? <laughs> Barco would know that it is a uh, a, a dangerous flower. Flower danger. Would they know that they it does a similar thing to white to me? Very similar. Okay. Marco, you would know this flower is very dangerous. That's a good way to put it. That, that's pretty much a... Just, could this be where I let my power from? Oh. Could be, if you want to go that route. I just, well, I just saw it happen and copied it. That or like a sentient one of these was like, yo boy, you wanna flower it up with me? Yeah. You wanna wink? Yeah, someone, someone oh, cast a wake in on one of these. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, that's a funny man. He's like, oh wait. Oh fuck, I don't know how to kill people, but it's so much more fun. It's just, I wake in one of these things, it's fucking terrifying. Cause then it's wait, is this him. the prisoner? No, no it's Felix. The prison, prison's not, not fighting with us, that would be stupid. No, he, he, he's this our... Is, this is one of the party members, he's... Yeah, he, he's prisoner. our... Yeah, he's our token wizard that goes first every time. Oh, the one that's not here. Yeah. yeah. But he, but he, he's... Rin's going to use him anyway, because all he does is fireball, so it doesn't make a difference. Okay. Well, he he, he also does uh, magic missile sometimes. <laughs> yeah, you know. He would do that. He would do a single casting spell when it's important. You know, it's crazy. It would help if he actually had an yeah. HP in his goddamn character. Yeah. So it would actually show. Uh, I, 
I, I can I can find it for you. Let's well, see. I, I know yep. what it is. It's just he didn't have it on, in the character sheet. Oh, yeah, yeah. On here, so I, are you are you actually made Kane in here? Okay. Oh, you yeah, generic rogue. Got it. Yeah, okay, cool. Not generic. It is generic By rogue. far, no. By far, yes. Your thief rogue, generic rogue. That's just for backstory. Right, for your... like that. Right, but your backstory and your actual class and stuff is generic. But your backstory, not. It's a different thing. I. <clears throat> Flavor is everything, but. <clears throat> oh my god, there's a lot of flower people. Don't blame me when your character accidentally ends up dead. God, what the fuck is this thing? I will, because I'll make a character kill you. Because there's no reason why you should kill another character. I don't have control. Yes, you do. Actually. It's your character. Actually. Actually. No, he has, control. He has control in making his character, so it's, uh, yeah. it's really his fault. But yes. After that point, not so much. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Right, things but he did things it, can but go haywire. Sure. But the same thing with games. Just because, just because it's not in his control doesn't mean it's not his responsibility. Yeah, yeah exactly. Mm. Oh, it's very much your responsibility. So you made another character that will likely just get killed by the party. That's good. Which one was the mm. first one? The bard? <laughs> Pretty, much. <laughs> Pretty much every character I think you've made in that game is just... Like, because Virtue had one that one it made friends with a poltergeist. That which was... is no Yep, and that's idea. the same campaign that I made the paladin leave, because I attempted to kill him. Oh no, I killed the paladin in oh, that game. Died. We killed yeah. him. I, I, I killed him. Truly grateful him. you guys did. I literally killed him. <laughs> because he was a problem. Jordan's just gonna watch. He doesn't need to eat all. Oh, if he mm. really needs to, he will. <clears throat> you two were just dancing about. <sighs> Fucking hell, 24 Celsius. Outside. Uh, it is currently 14 degrees and raining. I wish I was there. Uh, no, you fucking don't. Uh, what's the humidity? So the issue over here is humidity, pretty much. Uh... I have to refresh. I have play. What's my humidity? Who fucking opens Edge for fucking weather, you dumb computer? Well, a lot of people. <sighs> well, Microsoft Edge. A lot, of, a lot of old people. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yellow warning, apparently. Who cares? Fuck off with maps. I'm trying to see my fucking humidity, you dumb cunt. I'm just going uh, to do all blights on one dirt. Oh, 77% humidity. No, that's nothing. In a country when it's usually twenty, yeah, it is. At most, well, usually it's, it's like, like ninety serious. where I live. Ninety. Well, that's your usual thing, though. <laughs> I assume. It's awful. Yeah. <laughs> like when it's constant, it's not really a problem because you get used to it. But when it's like every month, it changes to a different thing. It becomes an issue. Blighter rolled pretty good. Just keep the up there. <laughs> would you think that minus 20 celsius would be a bad thing oh that's great i would love that i'm asking, I'm asking the person who lives the, in the place that has like 90 percent humidity mm -hmm. say that again no uh fucking minus 20 celsius uh what do you think of that that's nothing really where i live you can get to negative 50 celsius Huh. Sounds nice, actually. I live in a bipolar state. Oh, uh, yeah, like Virginia. Oh, it's only yep. negative four Fahrenheit. Negative four Fahrenheit? Yeah, well, negative 20 is negative four Fahrenheit. Oh, for, the Amer for the Americans. Billick. Being just those two. Combat has started. Do -do 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 -do. Oh. 
combat side, fireball. <laughs> so I'm gonna check through his spells. He's gonna use fireball. You don't even don't even think about it. You know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna cast that in the morning, whenever he woke up. Armor um, bag. Uh. Major armor. Yeah. Let me double check the time of that. Would have had to cast it again because it's halfway through. I just need to make sure. Yeah, just double check as well. Yep. Uh, and he would cast. So I think on on the D and D Beyond, you can change all the spell slots and stuff, so you can track it all on there if you want. It's your DM. That means I have to do D and D. No, I'm just giving you the option. Calm down. <laughs> Hmm. Up. There you oh, go. Hey, I'm not last. Amazing. Yeah, that's what you want to do. Or maybe the. I know that would be out, yeah. That one. And how are we doing area of effect rulings? What do you mean? Because this guy is more than 50% out. Yeah, then he's out of it. He doesn't need to. Are we going to do my rules where it's the third? Uh, 50%. Okay. Because five foot, that's big enough to jump out of the way. Okay. So. Well, maybe advantage? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, let's put ridiculous rules. You mean Thank jump you. out like if they had evasion? Mm. So but evasion, they would so just. Basic. So no, the basic. thing is, evasion is so good though that you just literally spin in a circle to avoid it, making a little mini whirlwind. Because <laughs> that's the only thing that makes sense when you're in the middle of a fireball. <laughs> <laughs> it's just fucking. <laughs> you you jump uh, thirty foot and uh, fucking twenty five feet in the air, you know. No, that's, that still wouldn't make sense. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See, the I the only thing that makes sense like, is you literally you're just doing a mini whirlwind where you're standing. <laughs> just to push all the fire away. Which is fucking insane. Take half damage. Hey, what did I... Oh, Jesus Christ, was you dead already? Yeah, fireball. No, yeah, fireball, of course. And uh, That's is, I mean, this is the main reason my wizard went to stupid initiative. <laughs> fireball first round, get rid of like. A bunch of ads, very useful. Mm. Very nice. On the next turn, they've all moved in. Bigger fireball. <laughs> Wait, why am I the only one who's Dex, Dex Tidebreaker? Because mm -hmm. I'm using PMB Beyond. Baku, what is your um, dexterity? Baku. What's plus three? My Dex is three plus. Okay. You should put it to a 17 then. Or point 0.3. Yeah, too much work. Technically, it'd be like point 16. Yeah. Or point 0.17. Yeah, <laughs> or point 0.32. Who knows? It doesn't matter. It's also kind of funny that the fairy dragon person is a barbarian. Um, Subverting expectations, isn't it? Melmar. 
It is your turn. Okay. That thing looks really big and scary. Yep. Yeah. Um. So, uh, everything in this contacting this circle has been hit before. Except for that, that has not been hit. Or it was. Or... But it was. No. Nope. It was. Okay. Except that. these two have been hit before. So. So this thing is hit. Yeah, that has been hit. Yeah. Oh gosh, I shoot with the arrow. And the big thing's been hit as well. Oh. The second shot. In fact, it was personal. So I will shoot that thing with. Eh. Eh. I don't want to use Colossus Slayer yet. Alright. Because you can only use it on one creature, right? Yep. Okay. Well, do you, so just. Do you think it's going to kill it? Was the real question? I was wanting to save the Colossus Slayer for the, the big dude. That's kind of spooky. So, so you're, so you're just... shooting that towards this. The first attack's towards this. Uh. Yeah. Okay. You gotta make tell me who you're attacking. So I know. So this takes twelve points. Still alive. It's still alive. Yep. Now I'll shoot it again. All right, and you're you were using. You were not using Colossus Slayer for the first attack. Second attack. No. Right. No. Fifteen. Does hit. Okay. Uh, ten. Ten. And that kills him. Oh yeah. And uh, let's see. Uh. Oh, you got dark mode on d Beyond now, guys. Wow. Uh, I want to I wanna cast right. Hunter's Mark on the big dude. Alright. How do I just... What is that? You have to have a bonus action and, uh, you know... I have a look. bonus action, yeah. <laughs> Use the spell slot and there you go. I have a, I have a spell slot, yeah. Yeah, done. Uh, so, what does this... Okay. When you hit it, you do an extra d6 damage. And it's easier to find slash on down. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. And it only applies to me, or...? Only, only applies yeah. to you. Yep. Okay. You might want to put, like, a little marker thing on yours, yeah. so you remember that you are concentrating on that spell, so when you get hit, you might lose the concentration. Oh, yeah, because it is concentration. Uh, shit, I probably shouldn't have done it right now then. Oh, well. That's yeah, that's fine. Right. You, you still have movement as well. Um, and I'm going to move. Uh, <laughs> Next to this one. Uh, 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 yeah. Real close as a ranger. Watch move speed. 30. If you pick up your token and press right click whilst you're holding it, it will do a movement arrow from your last point of location. Oh, wait. How did... I have an arrow score right there. That's my turn. Alright. Twig boys. Thanks, <laughs> man. <laughs> the twig sprints towards <laughs> Twig and up and Don't think I think there's one we can get to One of us Ah Yeah That one can't though So we got one more up top Oh 
uh, can it make a con save, please? What? Uh, this one. Yeah, okay. use my reaction to spore it. Con save for the twig. That is a 19. That's it. Yeah, DC sixteen. Is that it? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Say so, the same song. So. Okay. The twig default dates. Fucko. Did it not attack us? No, it, they had the dash to get to you. Oh, okay. Well, it's fine. Fucking wrong. Wait, when? When do these ones act? Oh wait, yeah, they all went at the same time. Yeah, big brain time. Sorry. Uh, Sorry don't worry about, about it. Them. No, 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 don't worry. Sorry, sadly not. My brain fucking rocking right now. Damn it, Sage. You can reach me. You're you're welcome. You, you, you can reach her. You get big boy points. Good boy. No. Let's get inspiration. No. Nah. This is good. It's a little, little bit points, then, is what you're saying. Uh, fuck, are you gonna get shot? Uh, is the needle blade? I always try my best to correct, even if it, uh. You know, yeah, yeah, it's, it's always doesn't, good. That doesn't, doesn't help. <laughs> it's sportsmanship. That's it, well. Baco does a fucking natural 20. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> Damn, what a, what a weird Also, I really was wondering when they were going to wake. Oh, yeah, because the fairy dragons have adamantine skin, so... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And if only. Uh, I don't have enough yeah, I'm kind of surprised there isn't an adamantine dragon, which would be fucking stupid. Well, there, well, there is. What, but, a real one? Yeah. Yeah, there actually are. Oh, wow. Jesus. In three or something. Yeah, third fucking, edition. That's fucking terrifying. Yeah, Especially for a, ra a ranger trying to hunt down a dragon. And it just can't fucking crit. Ten, I think Adamantia did something a lot different. Uh, yeah. You take 14 points of needle damage. Yeah, but then you update it to this. And it's just like. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. You take fourteen points of piercing. Okay. As the need the needle yeah. light shoots needles into you. It's literally it's just small thorns. Just a yeah, we need one more level and then you can be stupid. Because you, you could start raging when we draw initiative at level seven. It's really annoying. You can you can do that stuff on your token. Ooh. So if you click on your token you've got your health bar. Prayer by the number each. You can click in there, type in minus the number, and then enter, and it will subtract the number. Right, right, right. Then the bar will change. Right, 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 right. Alright, now, uh, wait, no. Find, find Blight. Quack boy? Blight Blight. Beyblade. Beyblade. Good up. Is this one not doing anything? Uh, it shot at Velik. <laughs> oh, okay. And there's two up there as well. Let's fight. Let's battle. Let's bang the battle. <laughs> God, he's dying. <sighs> yeah, it's fine. My utter dislike of Beyblades. Singing the Beyblade theme, or is it something else? Wait, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? I won't. See, the real question is, Elmar shot one of the mm. friends. These yeah. blights are sick. What are you going to do about it? Wizard. <laughs> Killed three of his friends. <laughs> they can't shoot the wizard. They're not that dumb. 
They have people in range. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I call them people. Huh? What? Plant. Oh. Wow. What are you gonna do about it, huh? They're gonna shoot you. <laughs> shot your friend, I'll shoot, I'll shoot I another like a, one. I feel like a good gauge, and if they're a person or not, is if you can cast and. Uh, my brain. No, it's. Also, the blights are currently under control of a lovely tree. Uh, I mean, flower. Wow. Flower boy. One second. Awaken. Yeah, if you can cast awaken on them, then they're human. Uh, human. I would. Like, a person. Your brain is not. If you can cast awaken on them, probably not a person. Well, they are but, after us. Well, well, yeah, I'm saying if you can, then that, yeah, then they're not. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Also, yeah, we could have also introduced Kane at the last scene. I could, but it didn't make sense. What's going on? Well, just huh? just did the thing. We would have just worried about it. Of it. So it's more. He gets to learn the the power of waiting, of patience. patience. Uh, he knows this. He's done that for most of the campaigns that <laughs> we've been in together. That's very oh, that's funny. Uh, it gives does. me time to read him. So. <laughs> yeah, that's good. What have you got something to do? Damn it. <sighs> okay, Brandon has a license now. A license to what? Drive. I thought he had a license. Uh, he had the learner's permit. Now he uh, has the full one license. I said we can murder people on accident. Uh, license to kill. Uh, does a 22 a hit you, Melmar? 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 Uh, uh, yeah, it does. Right. Uh, does a 21 hit you, Melmar? Uh, yeah. Alright, good to know. Again, it's time plants rise up. Oh god. Thirteen. Uh, Thirteen. Take fifteen points of piercing damage as two of the needle blights pump you full Jeez. of thorns. <laughs> Dashes. <laughs> He's slow as a bitch. Oh, now I'm moving it. Oh, that's fucking funny. All right, and Boko. Okay. How do I change the points, or do, do you do that? Uh, just click on your token. Uh, where it says fifty-two, click that. Click the minus symbol. And type the minus symbol. Press type, same to. And uh, type in the amount taken, so 15. Jeez. So do I lose focus then? Uh, you need to roll a constitution saving throw. Yeah. Or, uh, uh, two of them, uh, technically. DC. Feels too ten. 10. So DC right. Is 10, DC is 10. Or half the damage taken. Yeah, it's a yeah, ten. It's a ten. So roll two con saves. That's save. Save. And that's so, a yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah, let's go. So I lose focus. Yep. Yeah. I'm about to uh, dang it. Are you, you're learning how it works, so it's not too bad. I still have another. Wait, I'm probably just going to do cure ones that pretty fucking hurt. <laughs> or not really. No, no, yeah, not really. Not really. No. 
so, yeah, you, you should you should do Hunter's Mark first and then do that because with Hunter's Mark as a uh, bonus action, yeah. a bit too new person, but... It's like literally my first spell cast. Yeah, so. yeah, it's fine. You've got more spell slots. Do you have level two? Um, I have one more second level and three first level. Hunter's Mark is a first level spell. Yeah. Oh. Wait. Yeah, if you upcast Hunter's Mark, it extends the duration. It doesn't extend anything else. So there's no, no reason to upcast it. So can I just make yeah. it first? Okay. Yeah. So nice. Yeah, we've got plenty left. Here's a ranger you would know it makes sense to only do level one. Wait, Boko, it is now your turn. Okay. Um, I'm now in rage. And. I'm angry now. Roar. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking use my tail thingy so that exists. Oh, sweet. Because I like that. Got tail. What does, Very strong. What does tail do? Um. I'm just gonna reread it because my brain forgets as soon as I exit. Let's you use your reaction to add the damage to your AC. Swipe your the tail damage time. Oh, yeah. okay. It's a defensive thing, which is very useful. You can also use it to attack, but it's just better to have a defensive. Because I think you've got like, a great axe or something, right? So. 17 yeah. hits the twig. Oh, that's sad damage. It is, but that's enough to kill it. <laughs> you just crush mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Yeah. So, you still have your movement. It screeches and blam. I screech back. Tin plum. Yes. <laughs> hey, you know what druid? You don't know plum. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> You know, you know, wind talk. You don't know, Druid. Wish, wish. Wish, wish. Um, I'm because I can't remember what the fuck it dies. Yeah, that's one of the original languages, which is very useful. Mm. Me not being able to spell primordial. So, uh, elemental language, basically. Okay, thank you. Hehe, <laughs> that's So, you still have your movement, but I think that's it. You know what? Um, who seems like they'd be the easiest to throw to buff out of the players? The easiest to what? To buff, like, like, who seems the weakest? Uh, that. Eru. Eru. Eru wizards, that's it. Uh, the guy that you're protecting, that you're being paid yeah. to protect, also. Yeah. Right, but like, no one's near him right now. Yeah, no, Uru's yeah. the most uh, in danger. I see, I see, I see. Because they are small and a sorcerer. <laughs> I have 38 hit points. Yeah. <laughs> Literally half of everyone's hit points. Not pretty close to um, uh, the wizard. <laughs> no, the wizard has 38 hit points. <laughs> so. so yeah, those That's you cool. have very low hit points. They have a D6 hit though, compared to everyone else. Okay, curious, since I can't remember, are we doing flanking rules? Yes. yes. Does that, can they do that to us as well? Yes, they can. Yes. yes. Anything we can do, they can do. They can't have a tail. Ha, <laughs> fucking boomers. Uh, anything can. you can do, they can do better. Uh, I think do technically better. the big guy has multiple tails. Ah, so you're approaching me, fuck off. <laughs> Technically, you're copying him. No, it existed before you did. We have no proof for that. Give the fucking birth certificate. Copyright strikes. I was going to say birth receipt, but like, that doesn't exist. Apart from the birth certificate. Oh yes, the birth receipt. Yes. Thanks for paying us, here you go. Go pay us again for your baby. <laughs> I don't think I can do anything else because I can't do a. You can move. That's it, pretty I, much. Yeah, but 
But if you don't want it, you don't have to. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. We're not going to force you. I'd cry. Um, cry every ten. Mm -hmm. you move towards the little plant monster if you really wanted to. Yeah. I would love to, but I know that's dangerous. Is it? Dangerous. Ooh. That's it. I know. I know that ain't a salad. <laughs> <laughs> so I would just fucking hover as angry or fucking rage induced little dragon here. Yeah. yeah. So it is this beautiful flowers turn. I have to add. Okay. It's gonna walk up to you. It's it's gonna nod its head to you, say howdy ho. It's gonna go as it spits up something. <laughs> wow. Okay. Isn't that so sanitary? Uh, let's go. I don't have. Zombie. So I do have uh, ATST. So that's a zombie. <laughs> <laughs> so. Please, I know you have zombies, but you know. Uh, not on this account. <laughs> well, you have it on every generic. I, I mean, I have a zombie token. I'm gonna borrow it. <laughs> but the ATAT sounds a lot funny. <laughs> but also, the Roll20 has zombies in, as default. You just search something. Just all the fun. Sorry. Gosh, all right. We won't use the ATAT. I'm not saying you shouldn't, I'm just saying there are zombies. No, not now. Zombie gets spit up right there. The zombie default. Uh, as it waits for its turn, which is immediately after this. Uh... <laughs> Then this thing senses the weakness. Uh, oh, sadness. That yes. fucker doesn't sense jack shit. Uh, hey, Melvin. Everyone know what to do next, then. God, no. Get away from me. Uh, you're fine. <laughs> uh, it's gonna a tentacle attack you. <laughs> tentacle. Oh, so, oh, God. I no. hope you like. Off-brand anime. Um, I don't even watch anime at all. God, hentai. Anyway, I'll use my Cthulhu dice because this is called Tentacle. Um. Let me guess, crit? Did it at night? No. <laughs> but it is a 21. <laughs> oh god. Does that hit? Yes. <laughs> oh, even better. Does a 23 hit? Yeah. Alright. Right. <laughs> Alright, my Cthulhu dice. I'll put away my Cthulhu dice. Then uh, you get a 20. No, so... it's a 21. So. Right, we rolled a natural 20, so I feel like it's fine. Not yet. Cthulhu dice. I save it for all my Lovecraftian monsters. So... Alright, now, can you make me three constitution saving throws? <laughs> this, this reminds me of one of my favorite characters I'm playing. Uh, of my frog. Uh, quick question, does anybody remember where in the dungeon master the, co the cones are, or if they're in different folk? I don't know. Actually, I think they're in the fucking... I I just used the cones yeah. on the thing. Cause... I, 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 I clicked roll thrice. What? Okay. And it did this. Yeah, I don't know what that is. So uh, just roll normally. Roll again. I just use this for the cone. That's a failure. Just 
just take a little bit of extra damage. That's all. Use well for the counter, I wasn't looking. No. One of the measurements, we can just make it that. I feel the curved as well. Curved makes more sense to me. Base damage, then extra damage. Also increase the radius as well. You hear that? You hear that? That's the damage. Radius of one, which would be a normal cone. Oh my radius God. of three. Radius of four. Oh, look at that cone for radius four. Uh, that's a damn. That's a lot of damage. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Crikey! I like someone should focus this this thing. <laughs> you take forty nine points of damage. Fucking hell! So that that's death. <laughs> no, down. Down. You can still hit him. Did it? Did it? Did it? Actually, no, you're not. Did it? Did it? Did it? <laughs> you went robotic to that as well. That's good. Fucking hell, this might be a natural problem. <laughs> so, uh. <laughs> Uh, after its turn, uh, the zombie goes. So. Yep. Uh, it's gonna, it's gonna slap Bucko. Hold Fuck it on. <laughs> Does a 21 hit you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Jesus hold on. Christ. 18s and 16s only. Yeah, plenty of zombies, that's not too bad. Yeah, it's really zombies. not that bad at all. Yeah, zombies aren't that bad, it's just numbers. It's the issue. I just wish I could zombie the zombies. <laughs> if only. Or plants. You could zombie your downed ally. Yeah, I know. I don't know why I can't do plants. It would make sense I could do plants with the way it functions. Okay, how much damage... Yeah. Or do, does that hit? Does 21 hit? Um... I can't be fucking asked to do a little tail swipe, so yeah. Alright. You take seven points of bludgeoning damage. Cool, thanks. Which is half, because you're raging. Oh. Three points. I thought that was already half. No. No. He will give you the raw damage. Okay. I this. They're not. The character sheets and the token is not connected. This. Did not put a smile on my face. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And Iru, it is your turn. Run the fuck away. <laughs> you just need to, uh. See something. Don't fuck up. Huh? You've read something like this in a book once. <laughs> don't think it ended well for the protagonist. Or maybe it did. It depends on the book that it, you read. Endings everywhere. Hmm. Pretty fucking good damage for that. Should throw more of these at you. Uh... Hmm. So what's the, are you doing a line or a Would, cone? What a cone. Hit? Would a thirty foot cone hit all these? And back up. Like from if I was here, then like it would hit. Do you see the lines that I create? Uh, I am seeing one black line. The oh, fuck. No longer seeing that line. There's line. So it would hit yeah. uh, that, this, these, 
Yeah, if you go on your ruler stage, yeah, you can change the... change the drop down to cone. Where? At the top, there should be a cone option. This is a premium zone. I just have snap to center, snap to corner, no snapping. Uh, not in the actual ruler. Once you've had, once you select it, there should be an option at the top. Or is there not? No. Okay, that's a plugin thing. Yep. It's... Uh... So in the sense, it will. What are you trying to get? As many as I can, preferably this one included. You're gonna hit Bucko. Yes, no matter what, you're hitting Bucko. But you can get. It doesn't four. do damage. So you can you can hit four people, not including the big guy, and still hit the big guy. So. Fucking hit me, you want? So the it little doesn't, dudes. It doesn't do damage. So you'd hit the little dudes, the the twig blights. Uh, where, twig would I, where would I have to stand to kill them? But you are. Oh, okay. Yeah, you would just hit everyone here. Yeah. yeah I'm gonna cast fear. Perfect. I think you have advantage on fear checks, right? Or am I crazy? Uh, the project image. Oh, actually, before that, uh, I just remember something. Um, Where is it? Over here. Okay. Okay, yeah, uh, I'm gonna... Uh, use how to fill omen before I cast the spell. That's... On what retail are you going to use that one? On which? On who? Really? Sorcery points, and uh, yeah, it's uh, targeting this one. Uh, Orc. Uh, so I'm going to put it like here. Now, if I remember correctly, Creatures need to see you to be feared, yeah? Uh, look at the first one. Each creature from the 30 feet of cone of you must succeed. It doesn't say through. It doesn't say you have to see. I'll frighten. So you move away from you and save. Creature ends its turn. Creation where it doesn't have the line of sight of you. Yes, that's the thing. That's the thing of it, kind of. I don't know if it affects creatures that don't see. Wait, wait it would say that, but uh, they still have senses. They still have senses, but they don't. So those see. senses are right, but those senses are. Yeah, but they do technically say just not with vision. I mean, yeah, like if they have like blindsight or something, then yeah, they can see me even if it's not in the like visual so when that vision no longer applies to them being able to notice her then they wouldn't notice her okay. and then they would no longer be affected okay. so it'd be less line of sight and more <laughs> line of vision or whatever but yeah so this one has disadvantage because it's next to my hound and it's the target. Are oh, you also hit the zombie? Mm hmm. Cool about that. Which I think is immune to fear. No, I Maybe. Might be immune to fear. No, Makes sense. Not... Hell, those fucking twig things might be immune to fear. I don't know. Yeah. They're blind, so. That, that doesn't. Sweet, so I should cast deafness on them. Got it. Yeah, yeah, you could do that. Uh, so, are you a... saying that fear will work or won't work? It will work. Okay. Uh, this is a wisdom save. Yep. Correct. <laughs> See the DC right there. 
17 for the corpse flower. 16 oh, and a 15. That is a bonus. Yes, 16 and a 15. Yeah. And it has plus 2 to wisdom. Yeah. Keep getting fucked on that. All of your spells are big guys. Uh, the zombie. <laughs> yeah, so the hound needs to roll initiative because it's one of those. You probably want a character sheet for the hound. Does have one. I do. I, I have one. Okay, perfect. It's just before you. Perfect. <laughs> Some great timing. Cool. So the needle makes it. The needle makes it. So. Fuck it now. Jeez. <clears throat> Why am I fucking useless? You're not useless. Well, you still got the hound down, which will give it to on all spells, right? Or is it just yours? Uh, it's just mine. Yeah. Actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, well, the hound is within five feet of its target. The target has disadvantage on saving throws against any spells you cast. Yeah. <laughs> That's still fine. Uh, you probably want to move just now. Nah, you don't need to move. <laughs> Why are you moving? Mm -hmm. I guess I'm concentrating on that now. Uh -huh. <gasps> On the one dude. Two dudes. Oh, you got the zombie as well. Oh. Amazing. <laughs> I'm getting the feeling that you might want you're gonna read your cast a new spell. Different one. Like so. Yep. Probably. Indeed. Uh, is that I believe that is uh, my turn. Alright. Derek. Uh, I'm going to use a use of wild shape to symbolic end to get my 24 temporary hit points. Uh, I will move there uh, and say, turn around, say to Malamar, get the fuck up. Healing you for six, which is my minimum damage healing. Which is annoying. Uh, how do I? He's done it. What? And then I did it. Okay. Yeah. I am alive. Yeah. You are, wait, <laughs> you are prone on the floor. Prone. Yes. Yeah, you are prone. But I am in front of you, so I can take a hit. <laughs> so just like watch it, just the tentacle just go random and just just like mm -hmm. not even not even touch me. It just grazes my hair mm -hmm. and I'm just. Dead instantly. Yeah, very much. Head good. fucking, head yeah, fucking explodes. You got, got hit like three times. Yep. So it's very, very tough. The fun, first... uh, f funny thing, uh, the fucking hound has like almost. It has thirty-seven HP. Yeah, I think so it has like would... one less than me, and yeah. it also gets the temporary hit points. Jesus, and I th think you failed two of the saves. So that's why you took so much damage. He failed one. Only fucking out. Okay. Jesus. Yeah, I failed two. If he failed all of them, he could very much have just died. Oh, fucking hell. Because it does a lot of damage. It yeah, does okay. almost a fireball okay. per attack. Yeah, pop, okay. Fa uh, focus the plant. <laughs> yeah, it's my entire turn. That's all I can do. Yeah, well, I was, I was kind of hoping that it'd get feared so you couldn't attack. But... Yeah. No, it can attack to disadvantage. No, it has to use its action and uh yeah way. Very much yeah. because of the specific of the spell. Uh well for Chris Pre must take deck so also. Is that your turn, Kirk? Mm. Sorry. Yeah, that's everything. That's all I can do. Bellic. Bellic has a sound strategy in mind. <laughs> it's called Fireball. Um, where's he gonna place it? That's the real question. Question is actually does he take good. out does he take out the little guys or does he take out I mean do a bit? Well, 
<sighs> Could you know, if goes there, zombie? You could hit those guys and just take these guys out. Could. Or you, or you could hit those guys. That's the thing. Might not want to put it there because it's gonna hit my fucking hound. If he just goes there, then. Does he want quality or quantity? Get both by just doing this. But also, your 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 that doing what you're doing, Sage, isn't an accurate radius. Yeah. Because that wouldn't hit the, the, the hound there. Because it stops around here. Yeah, but if you get it here, then you hit like this guy at least. Yeah, whatever, yeah. If he gets here, then you hit that guy. Odd even. So he'll target the little guy. Okay, that's still very useful. Yeah, just putting it there. It's actually kill all the, not kill all the twigs at least. Oh, but it, no matter what, it'll kill all the twigs. Yeah, uh, and hopefully these two, which are kind of an issue because they're range attacking. And we don't know what this, this guy's going to do, but he's going to hit like a truck, I guarantee it. <laughs> So if you that slow, it's gonna hit like a truck. That's, That's okay. okay. That's okay. Uh, That's actually pretty good. Uh, That's okay. Double check. We'll get a, we'll get a bit more. Even if there can always be more. Oh, I should get elemental adapter or whatever it's called, so I can reroll. That'd be great. Turn that one into a two. Vine does save. Matters because all the other ones die. Sweet. They just have too little HP, even if they save. Perfect. That's wizard being wizard. That's pretty wizard. Yep. And Melomar, make a con save. Oh, fuck. <sighs> yeah, as you awaken Funny. and your eyes are watering now, because it just stank here. It's, it's the stench oh, okay. of death around you. Oh, okay, I've just realized what this is. I didn't even think what it was called. Oh, now I know. I'm gonna sniff, sniff. It's not for a minute. Yeah. So you're prone. Yeah, you are prone. And you would be aware that you're in its range. If you want to run away, okay. you still can. Yeah, I do. This is good. This is good. You should probably yeah, stand I know. up, use heaven, okay. and then disengage and move away. Or you could crawl away, it would be the same amount of movement. That would be half. Uh, yeah, it would be the same amount of movement. Yeah, because you use half to get up, or you just are half movement because you're crawling. True. So okay. staying, like, staying on the ground might not be the worst idea, considering that these guys are ranged. Yeah. You're likely range, not gonna... Range, range, range attacks have a disadvantage just, when yeah. you're prone. Yeah, I think I'll just roll, <laughs> just roll yeah. away. <laughs> uh, how how far can I roll? Half your, half your movement. Half? Man. And are you disengaging? Uh, of course, yeah. Okay, just checking. So how... To three. Disengage is just an action. Yep. So I guess... Do an action there. Yeah, there. Right here. you got bonus action left. Which bonus is... action, uh, I'm gonna do Cure Wounds. That's an action. That's an action. Oh, that's an action. Uh... Oh, there's not really much I can do. You could hunt smart. <laughs> could. Uh. Can't, can't really dash, huh? No, nah, that you're not a rogue. You it's you already rogue. used uh, your action to disengage. So. Oh. Okay, I guess I'm here then. Oh. I'm just, just, just right, right in front of you. Just like <laughs> you stank. You gag watch. Take a 
Let me take a shower. Now it's my turn. Oh, this is why you get tidal wave just to clean people. Oh. Stanky. Vine boy, he is going to utilize this. Uh, Tank plant. Mm -hmm. so I'm, I'm bullshit. This is going to Not that bullshit. <laughs> so it's still bullshit. <laughs> It's still bullshit, got it. Yeah, it's a lot larger than that. Whoops. Uh, Changes things a bit. Yeah, yeah, it does. All of his friends are dead. So, Paco. What are you talking about? It's a zombie, though. Zombie is not 15 or 50 percent him. <laughs> Technically, my okay, case not even because how circles work. Yeah. It's like 45 percent. This is why the third option is a bad way because <laughs> how circles work. Creatures of the blight's choice. That doesn't matter. Uh. Make a strength saving throw, Bucko. Oh, you might be okay at this. You might actually be okay, or you could oh, fail her. I get advantage on this, right? Yes. Please, two natural. That's a failure. <laughs> oh, uh, you are now restrained. <laughs> Which I don't think does much. And I give uh, you. Rest restrained makes you. Advantage. Yeah. Other uh, enemies have advantage against you, you have disadvantage, and can't move. Yeah, you have disadvantage on all your attacks, and they have advantage on you. And your right. movement is zero. At least you're not, you know, fucking... dead. But you're not either, so... I almost was. You're... You heal a couple of times. Watch a baby. This needle plate is going to move here. This needle plate. What was its root? Oh, it avoided us somewhere. It completely avoided you. It's, yeah, it specifically it's, avoided. It's not that dumb. It's dumb. But not that dumb. And I think your wolf can only attack its target, right? Yeah. So. This needle plate is going to attack Miller. <laughs> I just read the most amazing thing ever. If you're a gnome and use reduce on yourself, you weigh less than five pounds. Mage hand to just eat yourself. Sorry, <laughs> I rolled two sixteen. That is wait, that is wait, quite amazing. Well, you, you couldn't really eat yourself because mage hand doesn't have enough force to throw someone, but you can carry yourself. Uh, does nineteen hit Melamir? So yep. you could fly. You could fly around with Mage Hand. How you doing? <laughs> uh, Melamir, you can take 10 points of damage. <laughs> this one just... Uh, Jesus <laughs> fucking Christ. It is going to consistently keep as many people down as it can. I'm so glad I made some potions. <laughs> Other one's going to shoot Bucko. That is a natural twenty. This is a long <laughs> so that's, uh, Twelve points of damage, Bucko. So six half. Six. Slowly but surely, it's gonna eat away at you. <laughs> One of these days. Who the fuck's trying that shit? That. 
Yeah, the dude down the outbounds is boom. And Bucko, can you please make a con saving throw? Oh, sure, sure, hold on, let me just check Rage because I don't know if that affects anything. No. Not con saving. Not con saving. Not con yeah, and if you could just not care about the little things and attack the big thing, that'd be great. <laughs> and you are incapacitated. Well, wow, thanks for that fucking fast. I really appreciate it. Fantastic. Uh, and rage drops. Whoop. <laughs> and whoop. Because we should probably get the other dudes to to help us a little bit, yeah. You know? Uh, the stank got to you, you know. And, uh, yeah. This is what I'm Eh, he is nowhere near you guys. <laughs> Doran is, uh... Yeah, I would like to turn to... Yeah, he would like to turn to Doran. Uh, can you help a bit? If, if you could? Yeah, Doran is now just like, oh my gosh. <laughs> what, what, do you, what do you mean? He's so feeble. How can he help us? A plant. <laughs> Literally a plant. A fucking CR8 plant. <laughs> <laughs> and it's fucking 20 minions. Uh, like, well, first, like... the minions uh, have 4 to 11 HP. <laughs> yeah. One of them has 25. Action economy. Yeah, fireball. Yeah, and, there's only, and there's only like ten. Yeah, Not fireball fine. got rid of a lot of them <laughs> very quickly. Yeah, yeah. And it's consistently getting rid of a lot of them. Yeah, action economy sort fuckers this this time. Just, just fireball again, though. That and just one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So Bucko's just down, and that's their turn. Yep. Fuck. I join the party. <sighs> they're not dying. They're uh, they're just fucking sleeping. They will. Yeah. Well, not unconscious. Yeah, shouldn't shouldn't we like call for the other people to help? You yeah, know me. Boys. They have eyes, but it's yeah. more pro help these motherfuckers that. Have but actually also, done quite a bit. So you, should, you, yeah. you should probably roll Doran initiative. Yeah. But also, everyone in the party Doran's has a has healing. everyone in the party has a healing potion. So Doran's it's been more or less not holding as his much of an issue to the more or less till the end of it. Yeah. He so he's he's on zero then. Okay. Okay. Just do a six. Because he's. Alright, so which of these targets is the best to hit? The zombie. No, the weird wolf. It's running away like a coward. Uh, is it like it hasn't done anything yet? Not the zombie's turn. Uh, not yet, at least. I was just wondering how fucking the zombie gets scared. Brains. Oh, bad brains. It it becomes self-aware for a moment. God, what are you doing with him? Well, I was, I was a person. Why am I trying to eat people? Fear is the worst type of magic against the end. <laughs> uh, Bucko, you're going to get uh, attacked. Fuck. <laughs> it's so a... That's a it's a conscious being, and it sees yeah. weakness. That's a bunch of all time. These con saves aren't automatically failed when yep. you're a con. True. Very true. That'll hit. That's a 23. Can you... I'll just... One hit. Yeah. That's, Tail that's another is gone. Hit. Yeah, Tail's gone. That's another... God damn. Can you make me three con saves? <laughs> I love this. Can I, can I fucking crawl in a pit and die? Uh, that, well, you're yeah, currently you in a, fight. You're currently unconscious, so no. You're in a bramble and going to die. So big difference. Upside, didn't fail any of those. 
Yeah, you saved all, so you don't take the really bad damage. Yeah, mm. just take 66. <laughs> wow. Oops, I'm still 56. Wow. Wow, this is such an upside. It is. It so much is. Could have been worse. They could have been dex saves, which you would have immediately failed because you're unconscious. Yeah. Yeah. It would have been funny. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, sad. It would have been a sad, sad, sad time. They haven't even, get, they haven't even really got to know this character. Oh, wait. Hold on. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Do those different dice. Both my dice are in dice jail. Fun. <laughs> Both first rolls. Now. So, so you're aware there's a roll chat in this server? I know. I was just doing it for my own thing because I'm bored. <laughs> yeah, I wonder why. It's weird. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you be bored? We're having combat right now. You guys are. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, that's and, the joke. And roll that D2. Good. Uh, okay, tells me when you'll be joining. Dice. Uh, alright, so. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna need to pick up flying. So you take oh, thirty-three God. points of damage. Blight would have been great against these guys. Yeah, it's not next level. I can get that. <sighs> I could as well, but I'm taking other spells. So. Could get fire flame blade. So you're at nine HP, Bucko. You're still unconscious. But, you know, of course, it's a concentration spell with a fucking melee weapon, because that makes sense. Wait, don't, don't you wake up from unconscious when you get damage? Or is it? Or is this like a specific thing? Uh, it says they are incapacitated until the end of the turn. So just done. S until the end of whose turn? Uh, until the end of the turn. Okay. And also... Okay, so so they wouldn't be incapacitated now. No, because it's still the, still the same turn. Like, this is when the turn resets. In, the turn order resets, it's not when. So, that'd be so, round, not turn. Turn and round. <sighs> it's not to lie, my attention span fucked off. <laughs> This creature is going to, on a failed save of the creature until the end of the turn. So they would wake up so, at yeah. the end of their turn. Yes. So, alright. So the wouldn't have been an advantage to attack? No, because she's still restrained. Oh yeah, still restrained, but also still prone. Not prone. And court just makes you prone. The what? Unconscious makes you prone, right? Yeah, but they've been entangled and restrained in brambles. Yeah. That would not have fallen. <sighs> yeah. It's like a fucking... fucking wrapped around twigs. Because the twigs. Yeah, but if I was conscious in theory of the use reactions. Yeah. Though you would have lost your rage whenever you went unconscious. Good point. I could have still. I don't know. I'm. My attention span is gone. But you are now conscious and also awake to being pumpled to. Fan fucking tastic. Dead. No, not yet. <laughs> it's the zombie's turn. Zombie. Normal frighten just makes it so. They can't come near me and have like disadvantage on attacks as long as they can see me. But specifically, fe specifically the spell fear, they have to move away. Yeah. Me. 
There is action, unique user action to dash. Yep. Let's stay at the dash away. Great. Which means they don't disengage, which means back home has an opportunity attack. Baku does have an opportunity attack. So you are restrained, so it would be a disadvantage. Baku? Baku? Mm -hmm. Opportunity attack. Zombie moving okay. away. Okay. Then I think this is... It hits a zombie. With disadvantage. Oh yeah, you need to roll one more time. <laughs> that still hits. So fifty. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. oh, you rolled max damage, you got down. Yeah. He is still alive, though, and runs. Respect, will you know? Zombie panic. Yay, and my third level spell got one zombie to run away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, ah, oh, just shit. my fucking luck. Fucking hell. And zombie. that's that guy's done. Zombie is in. No, well, the plant still. is in control of zombie. So, zombie. Yeah. That is a 20 to hit. I think zombies have check. No, uh, no. 21 to hit. Where did the zombie go? It's oh. on the corpse. Yeah, zombies on corpse. So zombie. Zombie D. Oh. Zombie. Okay. I was confused. Zombie. I'm assuming 21 Zombie. does hit. Okay. I'll accept the silence. 21 hits. 21 hits everyone. Yeah. Doesn't hit me if I cast shield. Yeah, if you cast shield. Bucko, you are now on 5 HP. We can see it. Fucking hell. Am I gonna arrive well, uh, during this campaign to, to a death? You're likely in the next town we're going to. Uh, I told you to roll a d2, but you didn't. I messaged you. He did. I, I sent you it. Just I, he did. He wrote a two. I rolled it in our Discord. I rolled a two. Before I got your message, I already rolled it in I the didn't other Discord. Know that. I have all the roll chats muted. I literally DM'd you saying I got a two. Mm, I yeah, see it. I also have Discord muted, so I wouldn't have seen it. <laughs> yeah, he has a fucking streamer on. He's a bitch. That's so I don't have to hear the ding. Ding. Doggo moves here, so uh, actually, no way, it doesn't matter. Do well, yeah, he can but, give Drake advantage. Uh, but I would kick a bit of advantage. Nah, but it, ha it has back tactics, so it hardly had advantage right there. Oh, yeah, sure. Kiss me up. Uh, bite. Question Wait. Is is the dog immune to poison? Uh,. Or so. is it undead? It is a monstrosity. Ah, can it roll a con save? Yeah. Uh, it doesn't have Zom. specific for that, so just constitution roll for uh, mm -hmm. uh, ten. Uh, it is unconscious. So it... It's bullshit. <laughs> it's not bullshit. <laughs> Welcome to plant. <laughs> the plant default damage. Okay. Fucking hands. Uh, and the dog wakes up at the end of its turn. Yep, then, uh, yep. And then it's my turn. Yep. What am I gonna do? Uh, oh, hmm. I can hit two enemies if I do this. I think. Yeah. No, I can't. Yay, fucking shit. But if you deal with this guy, then the barbarian can start functioning. Actually, I think the brambles stay. You have to break free. Oh, okay. Well, oh, it'll still help. I mean, is it possible to do a fucking line attack like this? Lines exist how they exist. I'm asking Ren if it allows that. Yeah. 
Cool. 20 foot line, and I'm gonna use Umbral Slash. Slash X saves. Fine, boy. Boy, dude. I know Vine Boy ain't. Heck, fuck. That's a seven. Wait, when do they add Thundercats to Hulu? Uh, they've had it for a little bit. Hold on. That damage is wrong. Still seven. Yeah, that should be 4d6 magical slashing, not 3d8. <sighs> I'm just gonna roll it like this. Yeah. Probably not, yeah. I'm going to use some meta magic. To, uh, I'm gonna fucking empower that spell. So using one sorcery point to real roll. The one and two, I assume. Yes. The one and the two. Love life to the three, roll the four and the five. Okay, so plus four. So 16. 16. Yeah, yeah, I got one, one, one more damage out of that. Uh, <laughs> From the original, yeah. Yeah. So, I'm, assume, I'm assuming it's not in the shadow, so it's probably not taking that necrotic. Yeah, no. <laughs> well, technically, the butts are in the shadow. Yeah. Unfortunately, it doesn't count. <laughs> So the vine still alive did save. And let's see if flower. Uh damn, that's plus two. Damn. Not expecting that. Uh that is It does have twenty tentacles. It does have twenty tentacles. That is a good, you know way to get rid of the yeah, problem. Seventeen. Also I feel like I should clarify something for something you Sage. The omen, its hit points is only the temporary hit points it gives. It doesn't have the step hit points from the dire wolf. Doesn't? No. Because it says the following changes. So it changes the hit points to the temporary hit points. Because mm. it would be very strong otherwise. It's still fairly good though. It's got a decent amount of hit points. And it scales very well. Unlike most things. It does not scale at all? Really? But it does, because it's off your hit points. No, it's off my... Level. It's also a level, yeah. Which means at 20th level it will have 20 hit points. Yeah. Uh, no, I wouldn't 10. Call that good scaling. 10 hit points, because it's half your sorcery level. Better to oh, yes. oh yeah, I forgot it. This scales terribly. Yeah. The Hound is the worst part of this entire shadow thing. It's very, very frustrating. Because mm. it's so expensive. Better to do. It should not cost as much as it, it does. does. I don't see anywhere where it says that it doesn't have its normal hit points. Well, it, it's, it states with the following changes. So it changes the hit points. Like it no. I, 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 I see what you're saying, but I think it's how this is supposed to work. Hero is, it the, is at the end of your turn. Uh, it, it... Rin, I would like a ruling on this. Yeah, Jesus Christ. Give me a minute. I think. Sorcerer, Shadow. Uh, Here's a. It's medium, large, it's monstrous, here's with a number of temporary. No, no, it just it has the actual hit points of a dire wolf. Does it? Yeah. Okay. And it has the temporary. Just... 
It's pretty okay. good when you get it, but it doesn't scale. Like, you know. Okay, yeah, that's all. But it's still fairly useful. That, that makes it good then, actually. Because die wolves have good. pretty chunky hit points. Yeah. Seven. That kind of just makes the hit, temporary hit points pointless. Uh, the temporary hit points is just good. <laughs> it no, helps. The amount is not good. It's kind of pointless. It's kind of insignificant, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, but is that the end of your turn, Hero? Uh, I did the yeah. Yep. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Drake, so. please make a con save. Okay. Do you sniff that stink? That's a fourteen. Double shot. Just. Barely. Oh, fuck. I need to figure out what to do. Best part is about this monster. <laughs> Could have outran it. <laughs> Could have just left. Right, but that's not why we're doing this. Yeah, I know, but still. <laughs> yeah, we we could have just left. No, we can outrun it. Can idiots? No. Because no. they're idiots. Uh... That's frustrating. If this one dies, my next character's gonna be a fucking chaotic neutral asshole. I think my fuck. best option is to cast Summon Faye. I love that spam. Kane just appears, poof. Uh, I might want a character sheet for this room. I will do that after the session. <laughs> yeah. uh, could you plop down a token quick so I can like put the stats on that? Second. Something that's worthwhile. Ah, uh, yes. Medical droid. <laughs> Where do you want it to be? <laughs> uh, it. So I can summon it. With a ninety feet. Um, actually, this is scary. It would be large. So. <laughs> it's not. Not scary. It's so. it's, scary, scary. Counts, it's counts as small. A scary rolls in. Right. Shoots everyone. He's gonna spawn here. For the Empire. Mm. And it goes after my turn. Sure, it doesn't look like a monkey. Make it. Uh, just give me access to one of them, that'd be great. <laughs> Ugh. That's good too much. Okay, so let's quickly. That. That's a C. Okay, so that's that summoned. That's my action. My bonus action. I will gonna hungry hungry jaws this creature. You took a bite out of Actually. All right. Can't remember. Oh no, I'm not doing that. I'm just gonna I know I can't because I would cut this it's frustrating and I have to do the bite because I already cast it as well. Uh, oh, six damage. It is the worst thing. Yeah, but who cares? Uh, not me. Uh, trick, trick does. There's a ah. limit. 
this takes like uh, years, yeah but i can get temporary hit points from this we should talk about it it heals me it doesn't i'm not using that hit points it tastes uh, like literal death <laughs> yeah yeah pretty much take a bite out of one of its pustules juicy is that the end of your turn uh that is yeah. I will then move there. All right. And then it's my face turn. Ah uh, yes. Uh, and the face will, uh, as a bonus action. Use thumbing. Uh, which gives it advantage on its next attack roll. Oh, so you chose the uh, the angry one. Okay. Oh, is that? Oh fuck! I forgot. Hold on. Yeah, you gotta choose one of three. Oh, five, one, four, six, seven. oh okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm using because that makes more sense than anything. Uh, yeah. So it's going to get advantage on its attack. It will attack this one. The needle blade? Why? Yep. Uh, and it has my attack rolls. So I'm going to use my primal savagery. It's all the same, pretty much. That's a 21 to hit. 21 does hit. And it does. D6 plus. You could just click D6 and the other D6. Yeah, the thing is, I don't think it will do the extra because it's, uh, it's weird. It does 1D6 plus 3 plus the spell's level. Plus 1D6, 1D6 of force damage. So it's 2D6 plus 3, plus 6. So that's 12 damage with one force damage. Yep. So I thought, uh, and then I will have that move there just to get in the way a bit. All right. Durin. Now it's, now it's Hansi's turn. See, as Durin just sticks his hand into. Sticks his right hand into his right pocket and pulls out. You can see now he's wearing just like clawed metal jewelry. This seems to be like scrapey instead of punchy. Uh, but getting that bling. Yeah, he get that bling. Uh, and he is going to spell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is um turn two, I think. Yes, uh, more or less right after him, he was puffing in. Uh, it just runs around, hits everything four times. He is not going to get melee with anything. He's going to cast spells. Um. He is going to cast Hex no. on this. So you the will worst one. Say the worst. Uh, he is going to say no to Dexterity. Why not Con? Uh, because. <laughs> so, that's all my spells. <laughs> I only have Con. I think the bad thing with Blight is that it doesn't affect saving throws at all. So. I think it does, doesn't it? Nope, only ability checks. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, that's pointless though. That's the main reason why it's not the most overpowered spell in the fucking game. But, but it's not that as well because it's not good. So, it's an extra damage. It's going to. It's damage on top of your damage. Yeah, gross. I just want to upgrade and get a level level four spell and I can have someone fair level four and then have two attacks in a turn. 
I want to uh, I want to do that, but with someone inside of Shadow Spawn. Yeah. Uh, Someone's the side good on this. Uh, you see as he just scratches the air. It's just scrape, scratch, scratch. Uh, and the, the scratch marks fly towards and just pierce into the beam. Zip. Top tier damage. <clears throat> Zoop. Top tier damage. And 2 Oh damage. my god. God, that's fucking funny as shit. Yeah. Classic can't... Warlock. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can't add his charisma. Wait, is, is this Gabe's in character? No. He's rolling like it. It's just, uh, he gets oh. more punchy. Uh, so. He has Eldritch Blast, and that's what he's gonna use. Because uh, he ain't getting close to me. <sighs> That's weird. That's not his job to keep you safe. <laughs> job to keep you safe. Uh, yeah. And... Going to do... And now, some Kane. At this time, you crest over just a small hill, just to notice uh, a sizable fight as there lay multiple dead plants on the ground and one very large uh flower trying to eat these people uh, <laughs> it's always good to say it that way uh, also there's a zombie running away you don't know what the fuck's going on with that you would appear uh <laughs> So this is on me running towards him. Uh, past him. <laughs> it's it's more not even <laughs> trying. Gives up. You there, Fen? Yeah, I'm right here. Okay. You would appear there. There. Okay. So go ahead and shit how. Well, you already have it rolled. Just drag your token down. That's such a wide, wide face. I don't know token. why I did it like that. <laughs> wide boy. It doesn't even... You could, could have made it token. It's, it's more Kyle stretched right vertically. Here. You could have made a token though, so... You know. Could have. <laughs> uh, but mm. yeah, you notice the zombie just running past you. It seems to be having an, uh, a, a crisis. Okay. It's Velik's turn. So you pop into the scene with your initiative beam. Is that a roll of four? Velik. He's so slow. <laughs> fireball. He doesn't need the fireball anymore. He can actually single target things now. Yeah. But fireball might is wanna, the best thing. Might the deal might want to deal with this guy, though. <laughs> Before yeah. he just kills Melamar. <laughs> It'd only be one death save. <laughs> um, uh, it's a per risk. Hit. It's a risk. One, he's willing one death to take. Save, one death save per hit. It's a risk he's willing to take. How many attack rolls can that thing do? Before yeah. Melamar's going to roll a one on his death save. Yep. That one on his death save. It's a risk. Fucking a risk. Guys. We're also hiding death saves, remember, guys? It's fun. Uh, oh yeah, I don't even need to radius. We could just get that to where it doesn't hit you. Oops, uh, he's going to fireball, 100%. Literally. Whoa, fireball. The, the big, big ass one, motherfucker yeah. plant. It's single target spells that are probably more powerful. No. 
<laughs> actually, he most likely Fire dead. Fireball <laughs> is the most powerful spell. At third level. Yeah. Doesn't, he, upcast. he doesn't have blight. Right, but he, he can upcast the spell to third, which would do just the same amount. Yeah, so Fireball. Fireball is the best base damage, that being eight. So. Yeah. Dex eight. That is an eight. Uh, first fucking. <laughs> He has chromatic orb. Yeah. <sighs> the best part is he can also change things around to where damage yep. types are different. But it doesn't matter. He can, he can, he can make a force chroma chromatic orb. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's not that. Oh, no. Uh, he, wouldn't. he can change things to necrotic at will. Uh, oh, yeah, he's. That's nice. Cause he's a fucking weirdo. Yep. Vampire. In general. No, he's not a vampire. Go. Throwing out words. Um, As a player, it's pretty fucking obvious. What? Character, not so much, but you know. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, you know, if you, if you hang around those people, I think for like some people will get it. Sooner or later. Uh, I haven't seen him so. Yeah. I don't think anyone has. He's hidden it quite well. It's like it's a, a very disliked thing. Is it? Yeah, vampirism is a very bad thing. Uh, in most places. There's only one real place that overly accepts vampire. Like this continent? Uh, the northern part of this continent. <laughs> Not everywhere. <laughs> Give it a few years, maybe, then then this the the whole oh, continent. So, are you saying that vampires are like black people in this world? Uh, no, <clears throat> vampires are uh beings that gain sustenance from living beings, and people right. just don't like them because. As in, I'm vampires... saying in the way in the way realm of prejudice. Oh no, it's more because not the they're... reason, not the reason for the prejudice, but. Uh, the reason the why it's going to be let in is because Slady is, you know, a country. Uh, and it, sooner or later, right. will probably become the most powerful well, I, place. I, I feel like it's more because of how they deal with that, rather than... How they deal with vampires? Yeah. Feed them? As in, they literally just pay people for blood. <laughs> like it should work. <laughs> They're just murdering people. They just want a little sip. Um, Which is inefficient. Melimer, uh, roll it and save. If you just pay poor people, and then they won't roll be poor. Roll a what? Oh. A, a death saving. A death save. But hide uh, it. Whisper. Yes, whisper chat it. Uh, do not tell anyone what you get. If you yep. do, I will give you another one. How do I whisper? <laughs> Well, so, you're going, so, so you're going to your character sheet, and you're going to the cog, and then there's uh, Whisper to GM, and you put that to Whisper Toggle. Oh, I think we're going to put that on already, right? Really? I just... I don't maintenance uh, every single character sheet. We could have maintenance to every character sheet when you made the game. Nope. <laughs> so, in, in the character sheet, <laughs> above where it says Inspiration, click 2GM. Oh, okay. And click death save. Uh, okay, well, let me test this first. Yeah, that's what. Okay, now. okay, did you guys see that? Yes. Yep. Yes. First, you're using Beyond 20. I, uh, Beyond 20 won't work. Yeah, yeah, you can do it in Beyond 20, but it's more clicking. You might just do it on the character sheet. It's easier. Oh, did you guys see that? No. Okay, this is 2GM. Okay, good. Uh, okay. Uh, Dead saving car. Uh, and remember, don't tell I... anyone what you get. 
I don't really know if that's good or not, but whatever. <laughs> it's good if you get above a ten. It's I mean, bad if you don't. <laughs> Just don't say anything. If you get a one, if you get a one, it's really bad. Or a natural mm -hmm. twenty, it's really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. We, we would know if you had a natural twenty. That's it. Yep. Uh, Just that one dude now. Oh no, it's two. It's that little bitch. Now the real question is, how much of an asshole? <laughs> <laughs> I can't uh, kill Melamar. Could uh, you perma kill? I probably could. So I feel like you're now giving away what you wrote. <laughs> no. Because there is a uh, one thing. I'm why is why is there a why is there a metal good droid? Uh, uh, it's mine. It's his fey. <laughs> it's a fey spirit. It's a fey. It's not a medical droid. It's a fey. It's, yeah. it's a fey taking wow. the form of what it likes most. It's one of one of its favorite space opera series that it read in the fey wild. Because uh, it can do God. that. It loves medical. <laughs> yeah, you, 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 it had someone cast true polymorph on it. Because it loves it so much. It loves Warforged. Um, uh, it... Let's see. That. That. Where's that? Oh, that. Ah, yeah, it's gonna... Or you could do that. Shoot bucko. Oh. Okay. It's <laughs> a natural oh, 20. <laughs> <laughs> so fuck is that? Well, maybe I can roll all one. And they will still be down. Wait, what's happening? But uh, uh, Twig shot, 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 shot at Bocco. Did Twig have disadvantage? Cause, uh, oh wait, no, Bocco, never mind. Yep. Yeah, no, Bocco's unconscious. <laughs> <laughs> No, they're not. Are you gonna turn them into a zombie? <laughs> oh no, they they so they're down. Yeah, they're unconscious. Okay, that's annoying. Yeah, and the vine. Uh, sees this goddamn fade in front. Of it. Uh. Yeah. It seems that I was correct to be a little afraid of this fight. It's Strange. like it's a challenge. It, it, it's like there's a giant fucking corpse blowing fighting spur uh, part plant. It's crazy. No, that is not going to hit. I'm pretty sure a 10 does not hit the fairy. Okay. No. DC AC's 15. Because it's 12 plus my spell card, the level. Welcome. Just... They balance these sounds so well. Right. Uh, if you could, please whisper a death save to me. Sure, sure, sure. All right. Uh, and it is the flowers' turn. Hey, Drake. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> it's just gonna start waving tentacles at you. Yep. Now you see Stone. Get off my lawn. I'm gonna let you go. I'm gonna do something really fucking stupid next turn. Mm. That is it's a great idea. A 22 to hit. Yep. That is an 8. No. That's the lowest this thing's rolled this entire game. Good boy. That is another 23. Yep. And, and two concepts. Fuck me. Ah, yes. A failure. <laughs> Good. Jesus Christ. Upside, you didn't fail two times. Yep. And only got hit twice. So it's not. As bad as it could be. 
God, I would love for someone to get crit on all attacks. Oh, actually, the start of its turn, could it have made a con save, please? I forgot. Oh, yes, it could have. Uh, and that is with its bow. Damn, that's a good bonus. Uh, that is an 18. That passes. No. Plops are literally the worst sort of thing for me to fight. It's delicious. Nah, you take 29 points of damage. Yeah, well, pretty luck. Yeah, uh, that just knocks me out my temporary hit points, which is kind of annoying. Uh, and but yeah. This action. Make a zombie. Yeah, I don't give a fuck about a zombie. And zombies go? Zombie. <laughs> oh yeah, they're not tracking me. Uh, pretty sure that's not gonna hit. 14. No. Uh. Zombie runs up here. Zombie. That is 17. Hits. 6 points of damage. Yep. Zombie. There we go. Oh, wait. Here, wait. This zombie. <laughs> wait one second. Esther. Fuck out of here. Would I count as an unseen attack? Uh, at this current point, you are not expected. So you'd get surprise round. Or uh, not surprise round, but advantage on your attacks. Yes. Uh, question, what are you attacking? Big plant. Uh, then you do not get sneak attack on it. It does. There's, a. Uh... People next to it. Also, right. if I have advantage, I have some. But there would be. Um, yeah, you would have. You would have to punch, so you would. What? <clears throat> Maybe it's a punch, so I'm, you I'm don't. I'm pretty sure Rin just said. Against this one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I can have advantage no matter what. It has uh, blind slate, so it sees him coming. <laughs> cool. Doesn't matter. Steady aim. Yeah. That also works. <laughs> With my longbow. And also, we wouldn't technically count also, as Also, Elven yet. Accuracy, I get to roll one more. Jesus Christ. Since I had advantage. Hmm, Elven Accuracy. You're that guy. Elven Accuracy is a great. The bullshit, man. Yeah, fucking elves. That's why I max my fucking advantage at three. <laughs> because of that. Nine piercing, 14. God damn. So, 23. <laughs> Thank you for the additions. So much quicker than I am. Man, just add a 1 to a 9. That's uh, hard. <laughs> quick question, have you looked at the uh, the weapon rules and the uh, roll 20? Ah, he mm -hmm. hasn't. Uh, your longbow should be doing a d10. Oh. Ah, uh, yes. Pretty sure I told you, you about them. Uh, the range yeah. is also 200 slash 800. Uh, how do I change the die? On d and Beyond? Uh, you can't. I oh, know you can. Um, let me I customize. Don't. Wait, don't. 
Yeah, you have to do it on the. Uh, I know you'd have to customize the weapon itself. The easier option is just to put it on the roll twenty sheet. Yeah, like that. Yeah, if you just pop it on your roll twenty sheet, you can edit it though. It also has status. I don't know if it procs, but it also, but it has that. Uh, yeah, that's piercing status. So that's. No, you just love making everything complicated. Yeah. Um, uh, next attack point. made against this target has bonus equal to the proficiency bonus. So okay. plus three. So the next attack has plus three against that creature. Gotta love it. So if you just want to roll a d10 for now. Yeah, I'm going through and... I think you just roll a d10 separately and then configure how much... There you go. Well, God damn. That's plus 5, so that's 15. So that's 29. So, uh, so 4 at 5. 29 damage. How much was it before? 29. 23. So an extra 6. <laughs> Plant angry. Is that the end of your turn? Yep. And action bonus action. All right. Stop. And Drake, you would me, immediately notice the new person popping in, shooting the thing. Mm. Is that your turn? What else? He's such a. All right, Hound of Omen. Please roll a con save. Please work this time. It's Fucking a... six. All right, Iru, it's your turn. <laughs> could, <laughs> could I, not, I guess I'm not doing what I was gonna do because uh, fuck that. Can I be like stabilized or something? Nope. Is, isn't that a thing in the game? You but could. You can. If someone could stabilize you, no one is. I could help you, but I could also uh, not do that. Also, uh, healing potions are a thing. Everyone has one. Well, I can't really, can't really take one right now. No, yeah, but someone else could give. give you. Is, yeah, I could give you mine. Yeah, could 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 you oh, could shush. you do that? Shush. <laughs> could no. you do that? Hold on, hold on, I'm thinking. Yeah, look at the turn oh. order. He would be on. Don't mind this roll. I think I just fixed my. Or can't like you just grab yeah, my yeah, potion but... and. Yeah. yeah, but that would take searching. I fixed it. That would be uh-huh. I guess. I guess. I guess. Uh... Well, I think what you do is you give them your potion, and then once the combat's over, if they survive, you get theirs. Yeah. So that's just how that works. And if they Usually. die, you get theirs. So... Yeah. Either way. Uh, well, I guess. Okay. I'm just gonna give you my potion. Just well, I guess um, Doran could like do it. I but... am going to feed you my potion. Doran's not gonna okay, do that. Okay, I, I won't argue, please. <laughs> I yeah, and also, Doran's not gonna do that. He's not gonna search your body for a potion. Yeah, he Ridiculous. Don't care. He's, like, if you die, that's less money he has to pay, so... Yeah, exactly. Like, no <laughs> yeah, 2d4 plus 4, 2. You get... Wow. 9, Nine. HP. 9, yeah. pretty good. And as you wake I, up, I say, you owe me a potion. Can't really, can't really, like, so, comprehend words concerning... Uh, how much damage does it take in one hit, Bryn? How much what? Because I, I, I'm just concentrating on Faye. Oh, yeah. I think they save. 20-something. 20 26? Yeah, they both save them. But they're separate attacks, right? So... Yeah, they would have been. Oh uh, fuck. Uh, yeah. So either, either way, they would have saved if it was a one damage. Yeah. So that's why I took resilient. All uh, right. Uh, what am I gonna do? We got a bonus action. It's a woman. I want to just move away in general because hello, bitch.
you know, fuck it. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna use meta magic, uh, twins, not twin spell, fucking quicken, twin spell. Hmm. quicken spell. Let's go two more sorcery points there, and I'm gonna uh, cast summon shadow spawn. Mm-hmm. Is that a slide spell? It it is a third level spell. You can't. I know you didn't do a spell slot, yeah? True. Yeah, I just gave the yeah, forgot. Yeah, I forgot I was a potion. <laughs> Sorry. And a... I will use Fury. Let me uh, put down the token. Fuck Is this you. one of the book, weird book ones? No. Yes. yes. Yeah. I feel like there should be a... um. You should use the summon, like the Fey, as a blueprint for the new, the new stuff. I already have a token. I already have a yeah. I already have a step one for them. I'll be more or less copy and pasting it to you. Yes. Yeah. You know, but the Fey is pretty good, and it looks like very similar. So. Well, it is. It's the exact same, but dark with different. Yeah. Oh, okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. But it doesn't spam the entire chat with loads of information, though, so... Well, one is from d <laughs> Beyond, one is from Real 20. Uh, these act after my turn, right? Yeah, so mine works. So you got a guy going before your turn, on your turn, and after your turn. <laughs> Shares your initiative count, but takes a turn immediately after yours, so yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, so my turn's done. Uh, well, actually, I'll just like, move over there. Uh, Croc and... uh, attacks uh, door and punches you. Um, you know. Yeah. Uh, actually, hold on. You fail. Drop on the trash. There's one it's there. Not There's one there. I really wish they would update these um, token images things. Because, like, why is there not a brain image? A I'm brain actually going to summon it over summon here. Okay. Yeah, it should be there. No one should get hit by this. Yeah. Uh, it will use its dreadful scream that it can do once. Uh, uh, each creature within 30 feet of it must succeed on a wisdom saving throw against my spell safe DC or be frightened for one minute. Within how? What's the range? 30 foot. So each creature within 30 feet. So the fairy must be. Is, is this a charm effect? It is a fear. A frightened. It's a not charm effect. No. There's a wisdom saving throw. It's a zombie. Oh, Actually, it's... wait. Uh, if I just move it up a bit. Yeah, no, it won't hit this one. Oh, okay. It'll still hit with this one. Okay, cool. Makes it be easier. Uh, I'll just want to try and get. Yeah. Cut through blue dice. What? Uh, 21. 19 plus 2. Uh, it, I guess. Is, I guess it, would it would it have disadvantage? Because the yeah, no, okay. it's not. It's that's not fair. a direct. It, it's, yeah, it's fair. It's fair. It's fair. Uh, well, yeah, that's its action. It's fury. So I'm just gonna move closer. Is Bucko still entangled? Yes. Okay. Bucko still entangled until they break free or. Yeah. A minute passes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's going to be a problem. Actually, no way. Uh, it's going to be here. It's going to be there. Yeah. Yeah. Just outside the range. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Turn and... Trick. But that's... Oh, yeah. But that's that. Then it's my actual turn. I'm going to cast... Also, yeah. Sh- for uh, a description, sh- I would like to... Say a description for the spell. A fucking a shadowy ass creature just fucking crawls out of the ground. Over there. Yep. 
as a result, I need an attack spell at some point. I'm going to move there. Zombie attack. Yep, you can do what the fuck it wants. Punch. Oh my gosh. Does a 22 hit? Yeah, it does. Zombie punch. Mm, that is a 10. Which should just be enough to keep my concentration. Yeah, just enough to keep my concentration. Um. Uh, my headset is running out of battery. I need to switch to my phone. I'm going to be right back. Yep. All right. I th think I'm going to use another use of Wild Shape to get my hit points back up. And then bonus action. I'm going to cast Healing Word at third level to Melamore. Melamore, not Bucko? Uh, Bucko is currently indisposed even if I do heal them, so... Yes, yeah, one of those things. So another 15 hit points, Melamore. Because Melamore needs to revive, because Melamore can actually do damage. Uh, and Melamore. that is my turn. Will... It's not the end of my turn, because oh. it's my other boy. Oh. Uh, using Fumic, a fuming, uh, he will attack uh, this boy. Uh, uh, who did you heal with the healing word? Melamar. Okay. Uh, I, uh, yeah. <sighs> it's a you should probably put those back. Natural okay. one. I oh, know he has advantage, I'm dumb. I don't think I rolled advantage last time. That's 16 on the blue guy. Uh, fine. That hits. Okay, so that's fucking just 8 damage. Top tier damage plus 8. It does. Perfect. That's exactly what I want it. Uh, Fine. Melamere. I saw that. Hi. Yeah. You uh, did you put the uh, healing on your token? He did not. He just got back. I'm just reading the 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 rules, the properties, and shit. Yeah, I healed you. I healed you for fifteen. <laughs> Kind of feel like a lot of stuff to remember, but yeah, thanks. Uh, uh. No, that's my turn. All right. Could get up there. Yeah, he'll do that. Darren will run up. If you went there. For the punch on that boy. Could have got flanking. Yeah. Really care that much. Just a key for Uh. Double check. Kill damage. Literally just the reach for you. He punches the thing in the face. It collapses. No, it's less punch, more just 
scratches its head off. Just hit. Yucky. That's some top two damage. Is it real good? Uh, Drick, your passive's 20. One. 21. 20 will, would notice it. Uh, oh. As he scratches, he's fairly close to you. You can see how the... How the jewelry is there. And it looks like it probably could scratch someone real good. But you notice that his fingers have sharpened and elongate, elongated to the point to where it's slightly past the metal. To where the metal is just ornamental. As Interesting. He, as he is just digging his claws into this thing. Though it looks like the claws so he's, are... So he's using the claws to hide the fact that he has actual claws? Yes. Okay. Uh, Interesting. Give him a side eye. You always give people side eyes. <laughs> you a lizard. <laughs> Just stare at him. <laughs> Racist. <laughs> it's true. Um, and two. Oh wait, he attacked it. What do you say? Rockin. Oh boy, hex. An extra five points to him. There we go. Rockin'. Uh. Double check bonus action shit. Destroy. Black. There's a weird ass shadow monster there. It's kind of getting in the way of him not being able to cast a fireball because it's all of its spell slot. So. I'm gonna cast magic missile. <laughs> at. Second level. Oh. Give some four missiles. Magic missile. Team points of damage. Got it. I gotta message uh, Gabe something. I gotta mess him. How does he want to? <laughs> One, two, kill a plant monster? Question mark. He gets back to me. in 10 seconds. So you just see as uh, uh, about four magical, magical missiles just come out and just pop the larger pustules on the back of this creature? A plant? And it just falls to the ground. 
stinks. The zombies still going? The zombies are still here. Uh, okay. Still awake. Well, uh, the, uh, how did a little omen just fucking runs back here and phases my shadow? Because it's Target's dead. Even though it didn't do anything to it. That would be the next turn. Elmer. Uh, yeah. It is your turn. Big plant's dead. Big plant dead? Yep, big plant dead. Yep. Ooh, what is there? Oh, that be there. Zombie there. He's Zombie there. way over there. A new person? Okay, well, I'm still prone, so I'll stand There's up. There's also a person dying here. Oh. Uh, uh, oh, I still need to stand up. Uh, good. Uh, so get up, and that's an action, right? No, getting up takes half your movement. Okay, so can I like dash to? Yeah. You can. As an action. There are get... two. There are still two zombies. I assume um, still there. Yes, they are still there. Remember that Kirwin is also still. And and yeah, that's that's what I was. Yeah, yeah. Oh. There's a zombie there and a zombie there, but yeah, being worried about the teammate is valid because it might roll a one. So, giving a potion is an action. Using your wounds is an action, and dancing yep. is also an action. And also, I would say for you, looking at your spells during a level two, your wounds is never a bad idea. Okay, so. Move right here, and I still have my action left. Yep, action, bonus action. Oh yeah, you can't kill wounds, you have to get closer. You can only get, you can only kill wounds. Yeah, but you can't. No words. Yep. I guess so. I can just dash. Uh, over here. Uh, uh, that's pretty much all I can do. You could have not dashed and like shot at one of the zombies. Uh, there's a zombie right next to her, so... Yeah, if I miss, I... <laughs> you most likely won't hit her since... Well, she's, she's prone. prone. Oh, so not prone. I guess she's still not prone. Oh no, still turned it up in the brambles. Yeah. Oh, weird. But you're also a ranger, so if you miss, pretty crappy ranger. Just RNG slapping me in the face. Yep. <clears throat> uh, not much I can do now, so I guess that's just my turn. Oh, the plants are dead. <gasps> yeah. Plants are dead. I was like unconscious for eighty percent of the fight. It's so much. <laughs> and now yeah. Baco is dead. It's like, <laughs> Baco, if you could please uh, whisper, I'm not safe. Okay. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. <laughs> don't worry. If you do. Could I have stabilized or something? Nope. <laughs> that takes That's action. an action. Alright. And plants turn. Uh, so zombies. Uh, zombies too. Uh. Uh. Uh, you know, uh, you see, uh, it's gonna, uh, There's a little bee there. Punch it. There's an annoying bee. Yeah, punch a bitch. 
Uh, that's uh, 16. It's the bees. Yes. Uh, hey, uh, it's uh, gone. Uh, five big points old, of damage. Big old fine. So what low is the hit point? Zombie's just gonna... Be be fine. Uh, can it make a con save? Zombie, uh, can uh... Is it cool if I go skid out to go eat some watermelon? Yeah, you yeah. can get good water. Watermelon. You could get watermelon also. Yeah. Same thing. Only water. Uh, <laughs> Eleven. <laughs> yeah, hey, it fails. Eleven to hit. Oh, yeah. Haha, <laughs> it takes nine acrylic damage. Ah, uh, zombie. Pray. <laughs> it is gonna punch you in the face. <laughs> it misses. <laughs> I'm not even acknowledging the zombie because they're fucking bonkers. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, so only two zombies alive. Technically yep. three. There is one. No, all there's the three. Way up here. There's one over there. Uh, one that ran away. Also, it would no, it would no longer be frightened since uh, I, uh, I'm not concentrating on that spell anymore. Oh uh, yeah. Oh sweet. Well, so that zombie go. right here is oh, getting an so, arrow. So one second, that, that zombie would be a bit close. Yeah. It would dash <laughs> to you, brain. Oh, that's right. <laughs> <sighs> Wait, can it dash? Any move like twenty feet? Oh yeah, it would be here. Yeah. Brain. Yeah. Just, just out of your range. So not melee. Oh no, it would have been able to. Oh no, fuck! It does. Oh, that's hilarious. Brains. <laughs> just enough. Fuck. Is it gonna hit me real quick before? Uh, it, had, it had the dash. It had dash. So cool. it is within threat. Yes. So I can dual wield with two daggers, correct? You could. Yes. Do you do you have the? I don't have the feet. feet. Yeah. So you can only. So you can only pull out one. Yeah. Okay. Cunning action. Disengage. There you go. Perfect. And I'm shooting at that one. Uh, which one? The one next to the ferry. Okay. Where's my character sheet? That takes the most shit on. Best part? Uh, the necrotic damage was the first damage these zombies have. Yep. I know. That hits. Oh, Fucking hell, they've got loads of hit points. Ugh. Oh. They've got more hit points than anything no, else around them. I, I know I do have some ally with five. Uh, do we count as an ally? Do you consider yourself an ally, Melmar? And Borco is uh, Boko is unconscious, so that does not. Yeah. Uh, the Fae also, does not. The Fae does not consider you an ally. You wouldn't. So no sneak attack. Which is annoying. Fatal fifteen because he rolled max again. Yeah. And that was sneak. Oh, no. That's still 15 damage. So. Damage is good damage. And that's in my turn. I don't feel like engaging with okay. this right now. There's no need. So I move up. Uh... I'm gonna grab a drink. Gig, your dogs are barking again. Yeah. Either you deal with them or I will. <laughs> Gets out shot again. <laughs> Gonna take my back in a minute. I don't. I don't even know what they're barking. At. Uh, probably okay, she's a out. small animal. Yeah. No. A gerbil. Bad, bad dog. <laughs> God damn it! Just gonna, <laughs> yeah. gonna oh. cantrip that one. <laughs> oh yes, I use cantrip. Oh, that's a cool spell. Fucking uh, what a spell? I'm gonna shadow spike it. Hey! That hits. That... Oh, just hits. It casts shield. <laughs> uh, that, um, that damage ain't right, that should be no. 2d8. Yeah, that's an extra d8. You're looking for there, so... Hey! Nine! Oh, 
nine damage. Just enough. Just enough to trigger. Damage. Fourteen. Easy DC. Zombie still kick. Yep. Back up. <laughs> Zombie angry. Oh, I fucking love zombies so much. Like, right? Mm. Zombie laughs at your weak spell. Zombie go. Bruh. Mm, was, uh... mm. <laughs> nah. This guy's turn. Right. What's his movement again? Fucking. Oh, he has a 40 foot movement speed. That's convenient. He's gonna go over here and fucking slap that zombie in the ass. Oh, bunch. Ooh, it's 25. Zombie looks at Shadow. Zombie winks. That's a uh, 12 cold damage. The shadow winks back. <laughs> After this, they're gonna get a drink. They're gonna get a cold brewski. In the underworld. Yep. Does not kill it. Or proc. Mm -hmm. It literally just went away. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it does. It doesn't have multiple attacks yet, so that's uh, that's it. Oh, that's funny. To Rick. Uh, I guess it's turn turn. Doesn't do anything. I'm gonna cast Moonbeam on who? Uh, I will do this. And where? There. Okay. Things happen depending. Yeah, I know. I'm aware. And it's radiant. Sizzle, sizzle. So, any damage I do will kill it. Since it's 2d10. Uh, brain. Oh, you should tons. Anything you can actually. <clears throat> yep. Uh, okay. And I will go. Uh, move to there. And I'm going to. Can I use the rest of my turn to try and assess and see if she's okay? Yeah, but I'll see, yes. So she's using my bonus action to see if, she, if she's blood out or not. Yeah, that works. Or cl close to. Medicine. Okay. So what It seems like they're all right. They're still alive. You can see the faint breathing, but they have lost okay. blood. So they seem to be holding on pretty well. Okay. I just turned to my uh, healer quick. Robert's Still gonna done. punch in the butt. Yep. Do what the fuck it wants. It's a dumb bitch. 20. Uh, oh, wow. It just is. Zombie powers. Oh my god. Seven points of damage. Zombie Ooh. punches you in the ass with full power. It wants you in on the action, too. It, it kills some of my weird spores. I know. Zombie action. I have returned. Indeed. And is that the end of your turn? Yeah, that's the end of my turn. I should probably put the circle down before some idiot walks into it. Uh, this guy's gonna step here, and the shadow is an ally, so... Or does the shadow consider Durin an ally? That's the question. Yes, it probably yeah, doesn't it. acknowledge its existence, so... It doesn't really care it's attacking the zombie. Right. Is that what this was told to do? That black circle is a moonbeam. Danger. Oh fuck, my Faye goes. I'm done. Faye, ow. Just peace. How much light does that get off? Uh, an amount. 
Uh, I need to check how much my movement is. Speed boy. So I think if I could get to there, give him self advantage. Zombie. No, I need to. I swear I need to know how much moonlight that gives off. That's uh, 18 to hit the zombie. Oh, that don't you don't need to worry about that. Okay. I'm saying uh, the Fey. This is for because he would go after me. So. Okay. So it's an 18 to hit, doing 2d6. Alright. For 6, that's 10. And then he can move up to get the other advantage. Uh, Saved. It wakes up only like, Rob yeah. died today. And he does. Yes, I think. It, it does do force damage, but I don't think that matters. And you just see as he punches the zombie's head, or no, not punch, I always forget, scratches the the throat of the undead as the head just falls and dies. Did not save his damage. Rolled a good old two. And the moon moon doesn't emit light, the only, only inside the circle is light. Use one more zombie. Zombie. Zoom. Zombie. Oh, actually. Oh no, if I can cancel that, the fame would disappear. Because maybe. Oh, then. Either way, it all works the same. Yeah, it all works the same. Keep forgetting. Like Concentration, savage. Try to snipe it. I uh, pretty much actually probably can. Got fireball, right? I use fireball. He has magic missile. He also has message. Yeah. Hey, stop, Zombie. Stop. No. So, <laughs> violated the law. Straight the court of five. Level two. Top tier. Magical orbs be slapping that zombie. Wait, no. Here, wait. Fuck. I gotta roll that. I gotta come up, check. <laughs> zombie powers. Activate! It's still alive! <laughs> it, it would do that for each hit if it went over. Oh fuck, yeah it would. Oh yeah. no. Now we watch for the god tier zombie for saving all of them. Oh fuck. So that is save one. Oh shit. Wait, also this zombie hasn't taken a hit yet, has it? It has. It has taken some damage way before it was the first zombie spin. Oh. That saves. That saves. Yeah, yeah. Just saves. Yes! Zombie. <laughs> fucking love when zombies do this shit, it's so fucking funny. Zombie powers, activate. Zombie. Zombie. Zombie be zooming. Upside, zombies do have a pretty good shot. Yeah, they do. That's kind of, that's kind of the point. Yep. Such a great ability. So funny. Man Man of Who He was currently deafened. I don't know why he deafens himself. Confuses me every time. Maybe he's jerking. Then why is he deafening him? Uh, he's courteous. Like, muting would be courteous. Deafening is just pointless. Well, you know? deafening... Makes me. I think. Makes you what? Makes you mute. It's you. Right, but you could also just mute. Yeah. Who doesn't want to hear people? Like silence. That's boring. Uh -huh.
Oh my god, he actually has all the maps now. All right, back to yes. <laughs> I thought he already did that. Nope. <laughs> no, he just <laughs> bought the bundle. He's been yoinking all the maps from Pinterest. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't, because that's why they look so fucking bad. And also, good luck fucking finding them. Google images. Because roll 20 is a bunch of twats. Uh, Alright. Since Melamar isn't here, he's just gonna uh, default dance and press heal. Um, yeah. Fuck your wounds. I cast Cure Wounds. Oh, he doesn't have that here. But 2d8. Plus his wisdom? Yes, yes, yeah, hello. Hello, yes. Alright. Yeah. We assume you're cure wounds, so. right? Roll heal. Cool. Uh, yeah. Uh, is, it, is it over? Roll your no. healing damage. No. Oh. Is that I'm, I'm healing uh, Boko. Are you healing yourself or are you healing Boko? Uh, Baco, 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 Baco. Nearly tripped him. <laughs> Roll that to your way. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Well, wow. Not bad. That was actually quite bad. Baco is now conscious. Holy shit! You awaken to a lot of dead. Around you, and just a massive beam of light to your right. Uh, just five more minutes, I'm taking another nap. You are also still tangled up in brambles. Yeah, yeah you so. were like swat. You're not being swaddled. It's more like there's also a fucking shadow monster over there. It's kind yeah, of more like a rough and a stranger in front of all of you. You guys are the shadow monster. Yeah. You know what? This is a nightmare. I'm going back to sleep. Because... <laughs> Getting swaddled by some vines. Nice. Yeah. Dead zombie beside you, it's smoldering. A lizard. Um. The rotten corpse creature? Yeah, yeah the, the corpse flower <laughs> is still there. It's dead, though. There's what a stranger you... up ahead. Yeah, I guess about the stranger, I guess. So. <laughs> yes, yeah, so now it's Bokka. <laughs> I have like zero. I actually have no money on this character. You would, you would, you would have started out with 100 gold. Okay, thank you for telling me that. Okay, what the fuck am I doing? You're welcome. You're currently tied up, so you use your action to break out of it. I, I do that. that or, you could, or you could just wait, and then you'll eventually fall away. Yeah, <laughs> you could do that too. Patience? No, no, we don't have that here. Um, fucking athletics. Is strength? Athletics. I was about to ask. <laughs> Cool, I, that was still GM. Yeah, you break out either way. Just tear through the brambles. Also, what you could have done is rage and you would have an advantage on it. You know, very born. Oh yeah, but I'm too sleepy. Very important. Yeah, very important. I just woke up. I'm sorry, I mean you. I will say, do not touch the light when you wake up. It burns a little bit. I wasn't to? going to, but now you said it. Do you want to shower okay. in gold and moonlight? Yeah. yeah. You know what? I no longer want to go in there. Yeah, yeah. I feel like other what? reasons why you don't want to go in there. Why not? No. I don't know. Just, Only just... upsides. Modern problems require modern solutions. But yeah. I don't know. The problem or solution is, but it's something. But do have a movement and bonus action. Holy shit. Um, why is it initiative still gone? Yes, because there is still one zombie. <laughs> Who's the prick? Uh, it is all the way up here. <laughs> oh, okay. I can fucking dash to him. You have bonus action dash. Do I? No, you don't. Unless you do. Then you do. But I don't think you do. Unless you do. Well, when you rage, uh, you get some movement. If you're using the uh, variant rule from Tajus. Though doing that, you get rid of other features too. 
No, you don't. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna, yeah. The, the, the Tasha's thing where you get extra movement on your rage doesn't get rid of anything. It's only an extra thing. Yeah, at least, if two, I remember correctly. Sending what to me? Dick pics. Ah, okay. Okay, so... Why would you do that, Kurt? Because she would know that. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Um, out of curiosity, yes, indeed. Um, fuck. I was reading. I forgot what I was going to say. Hold on. <laughs> what I'm currently reading and go back to what I was previously reading. I should constantly message you during these games, perfect. It's funny, I have not a single ounce of concentration accurate to the character system. Um, but if I jump, does that mean I can go further? No. no. Didn't jump. Hit. Unless you have jump, jump would... spell active. <laughs> yeah. Make a strength check and extend your jump by a number of feet equal to the check's total. Yes, yes, but, but um, your movement, it will still count up to your movement as part of your movement. Yeah. So if you jump 20 feet, that will take 20 feet of your movement. There's only so a few times that different. breaks, and that's yeah. whenever you're a frog. Yeah, frog, jump spell, the monks also get nifty abilities that extend jumps. Okay. Also, no normally jump spell doesn't do that, but... Or, uh, jump, just triple shall jump, so... Distance. Yeah. Yeah. So if you did a running point. jump, that would d double that as well, or triple it. So, be pretty good. It still doesn't give you movement, though. No, it doesn't give you movement, but it would still extend past your movement if you jumped. If it went beyond your movement. You're not taking another nap. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, you did got get fucked up quite a bit. Yeah. Which is rare for a barbarian, so... Yeah, because I was fucking tangled up in a shit ton of branches, and I was, like, unable to do jack shit, and I was knocked out and beaten up, so I didn't even have fucking... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it went real bad for you. If only you all, you know, weren't swarming it, it would have tried to eat one of you two. Yeah. I was literally just there just to soak up hits. That's the only reason why I went in. Oh, you stepped into it? Oh. No, I didn't see that. I was fucking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so uh, what you do on your turn? Or... How do I roll to take a nap? Uh, you, you just, <laughs> you, you you just, just take, stop. You just say it and it happens. Well, I'm having another little nap because. In the moonbeam? In the ray of moonlight? No. Oh. No, that's next year. <laughs> just, wa just wash your hands in the moonbeam. Yeah. <laughs> This really hurts. Whiff. My skin is peeling off. Interesting. So warm. Zombie. Dead. Zombie. <laughs> it can't do anything, but it dashes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, bonus action. Cunning action to disengage these down here. And I turn oh. Not, not into the moonbeam? No, not in. <laughs> oh, that's great. You see this yeah, we should cast moonbeam on you, though, so we know if you're a shapeshifter. <laughs> One, that would be silver that would test that. Or oh, maybe Also oh. moonbeam. Moonbeam literally has a thing. Yeah, it's, it's, part, it's, it's actually part of the spell. Uh, 17 hit? Uh, 17 does hit the zombie. Do not have sneak attack, so don't mind. Why did I? Didn't I even do the thing I wanted. Fucking damn it! Points of damage. Wait, where's my dice set? The mm. high six you got there. If you want to read that, you can see. Nope, it's it's alive. Oh, silvery. Okay. Great. Yeah, that's one of the main things with main beam. Zombie's still alive. It takes the arrow, eats it. Spits it out. 
braid. A race of the knee. That is an interesting phrasing for that. Yeah, it is. It's very, very Shape useful. Changer. They transform into original form. Yeah, which is terrifying for some things. Yeah. And for some things if they are like. weren't originally a shape changer, though. Then it. Then it. You shape change into your. You change into your form. Your true yeah. form. Okay. Is more yeah, because like every shape changer okay, has. Because that's just. Like a werewolf would turn into a wolf. Yeah. Okay, because that's just. That phrasing. Like if bugs I, me. Yeah. Like a doppelganger will turn into a doppelganger. A werewolf. Werewolf. Or. Werewolf will turn into a werewolf. Uh. The, if, it's their truest form, basically, yes. whatever that is. So if you're a human with shape-changing abilities, you'll just turn back to a human. Which is weird, but yeah. But either way, you'll be changing form, and it'll be obvious. So. Okay. Love being druid. Druid's is that, great. Is that your turn? Yeah, uh, that was action, bonus action. Uh, the zombie on. is back. He's coming for you. Yep. I'll like move over here and just fucking this guy eats up there and <laughs> slaps slaps the fucking zombie. Right. So you do nothing on your turn. So no, it's still left. <laughs> <laughs> that zombie is unkillable. I fucking love zombies. It's, it's the so power cool. of a zombie. Would you allow me to still cast a cantrip on it? Uh, yeah. Cool. So, no, that's the wrong cantrip. <laughs> <laughs> this is the correct cantrip. Alright. Well... It makes it. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when zombies do this. It's so fucking funny. I love zombies. Should I be, should I be a dick? Okay. Yeah, so for my turn, bonus action. Oh, wait, this takes my action, I think. Uh, I need to move so I can highlight this. <sighs> so I'm going to move this 60 feet. So that's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Wait, what? Don't. The... Yeah, I am moving it, so it will literally just brush past him, but not touch him. It uh, just goes straight to the zombie. Okay, so it would not touch him. All right. It would not touch him, but it would be close. All right. Glares at it. <laughs> <laughs> giving giving him a glare. What's the doing? It's it's more just it's a glare of he knows that hurts. <laughs> Uh, does my does my shadow thing take damage from that? It would, because I wouldn't have I wouldn't be able to hit the zombie and not hit you. That's the saving throw. It's also a summon. Uh, wisdom. I think is it wisdom? Oh, con. No, it's con. Oh yeah, everything of mine's con, of course. Because why not just have con saves for everything and then fight plants? Wow, eleven <laughs> nails. Oh, sweet. The, the zombie just dies. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm up. It takes radiant. Sad. It yeah, I want to know how much. Da- I want to know. I want to know how much damage my shadow eight, takes. Eight. Eight. Oh eight, no. Eight. Right. Oh no! It's now. It's still up because summons are actually decent. <laughs> it actually has HP. My summon almost has. My summon almost has more HP than I do. Well, yeah, it has a little bit less than I do. And if you upcast it, it will have more hit points than you. Yep. Which is <laughs> <laughs> funny. Yeah. 
Uh, and what I'm gonna do is just brush the moonbeam over any undeads. Oh. Whilst we have, whilst it's still up. Alright. Yeah, sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. Sizzle, sizzle. Just to double check. They all <laughs> did. Be nice and cooked. Mm. You see Doran takes off his finger claws. Fingers are normal. As he puts them to his bucket. Hmm. Shadow monster slowly drifts towards me and just using my shadow. It's not the strangest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> just walks away. I'm just like, indeed. Giving him another look. <laughs> look at you. That's the gun on the slog. Look at his hands. <laughs> Squint at you. Appreciate you helping out. Yes. Yeah, it's more effective than you uh, appear to be. What do you mean? I am frail, so I can kill people. <laughs> no, anyone can kill a man. I was I was talking to uh, this person. <laughs> two two conversations going on at the same mm. time. Perfect. Except apparently the person I'm talking to doesn't understand what I'm saying. No, he never I understand. <laughs> I know common. Do you? Yes. Are you sure? I'm speaking in infernal. Oh. Not really. Uh, just... The devil tongue makes sense. This is one of them devil people. Wait, is that not, not common tongue? That depends on where you are. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Uh, thanks for the help. I appreciate it. Ah, the strong, silent type, eh? Oh, time to kill him. I just don't know what else to say. <laughs> You see Kane right. just start going into his pockets. Is Boko fucking dead? No. Huh? No. Why is it not text out? Oh my god, she fucking did. What? You no, know, it's because she's under the zombie. Oh. Okay. I don't see she's... that. I don't see that either. <laughs> for me, for me it... she's still under the zombie. Oh, okay. No, I see this. I see oh, this. Rolls, You're such a piece of shit. Yeah, such a piece of garbage. What I was trying to like calm the dogs down. What did I miss? Uh, we won. Uh, we I uh, we the zombie took about twenty hits, and then I moved and beamed it. <laughs> because then, so what's up with this new person that just showed up at random? That is where we're at. You've caught up. Yes. Yeah. I I was just thanking them, but the, they uh, are not. Speak back, which is kind of fucking weird. I have. Hello? Can you hear me? Can you I mean, hear me? Yeah, I, can hear you. I can hear you now, but you no. didn't. I couldn't hear you when I was speaking to you in character. I, I was talking. I couldn't hear you. I'm sorry. What, what did you say? Why, of course. Okay. Well, that's weird now. That's... Yeah, okay. actually talk. He, she, I don't know, elf. Him, half elf. Okay, I'm gonna vibe check. Yeah. Vibe check, now to 20. <laughs> After a little bit of searching through his pockets and bags, he finally finds what he's looking for. Pulls out a brooch. To be. Chaotic. Interesting. I'm eating a spoon. What? Of peanut butter. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just eating a spoon. I'm not peanut sick butter. right now. <laughs> 
eat the whole spoon, middle and all. Uh, uh, I had a D and D character that did that. His rations were spoons. Yeah. A good day it was. I think I remember the story about that game. Uh, Cinder was after weird. a little bit. Once it was like great movie, Brian. Once Kane finds that brooch, gets up, walks towards the lizard. To him. It's a brooch of a stag. You can roll a religion check. Uh, With advantage. Oh, advantage. It's a little. 15. If Boko was awake, they would roll. With it, actually, they'd probably just immediately get it. They wouldn't even have to roll. Because <laughs> they lived their, their life. <laughs> so. Yeah. Uh, Bok, uh, uh, Derek, you notice this symbol, uh, it looks very familiar, uh, to a symbol that you once seen, uh, uh, the, the regal symbol, the holy symbol, the, uh, symbol, symbol, the symbol of, uh, the Lord of the Hunt. A fey lord of the summer court. Okay. Uh, what do I know about now him? Also, go ahead and roll me another religion check or nature. This one can be used with. Be putting things together. Right. So I could do a nature wisdom check? Nature wisdom check, yes. Ah, sweet. I use medicine. Because it's one yeah. Right One of the few times doesn't matter. The correlation <laughs> does not go through. Oh god. Jump for you, buddy. So what do I know about the summer court uh the hunt dude? Uh the Lord of the Hunt. He is a fickle thing. Um he normally uh is a neutral lord. Uh though more often than not, he is working with the Summer Court, uh, which is the good guys in the Feywild, if you could consider Fey good. Um, we shouldn't. But you know that he is a mainly martial thing. He is based around hunting. Uh, you would yeah. also know the vagueness of his uh, military faction, what would we call it? A uh, a group of people that worship him and serve him in the Fey Wild and outside of it. Uh, people or beings known as the Wild Hunt. Uh, not good things, though uh, they are neutral in and of themselves. They just exist to hunt. Like their best. So is that anything, anything or very specific things? Hunt anything. So they don't even care what it is. The bigger the game, the better it is. Okay. So like even other fae. Oh god, yeah. Uh so okay. it's more just a sport at that point. Uh it, they are literally the people of sport. Oh, I've got a fun idea to sell them all, but that's for later. So he generally, I assume, is very neutral. Yes. But does he prefer to help Faye more than anyone else? He depends. The best way to put it, it depends. So it doesn't. So it doesn't. So he's completely neutral. Okay. Uh, he helps whenever it helps. Okay. Okay. Then I would just look at you. Senior. Right, yeah. I say that again. Kyle. Ice. <clears throat> One. I assume you recognize this symbol. I do. Then you must know why I'm here. Uh, what are you hunting? I'm not exactly hunting, for 
My lord sent me here to help you and your party, since you helped him. Visibly confused. You see... Go ahead, DM. Oh, with that little tidbit of knowledge, you could roll a history check with disadvantage. Or a nature check with disadvantage. Okay, nature, I'm a little bit better than that. Oh, 14. 14. It doesn't click. Hmm. God damn it, another fucking fae. Huh, bitches. <laughs> How many of these are gonna fucking come up? Jesus Christ. Gotta love so much this one. That's gonna be a lot in this campaign. I want to you see. <laughs> yeah, still I see. You see that group you wiped out not too long ago? They Indeed. were hunting my lord's kin. He sent me here to make sure everything goes smoothly, smoothly, and help smoothly. you in any way possible. Ah, oh, just now, more assistance. Now okay. it clicks, Drick. You now remember Leshens are the children of the Lord of the Hunt. Ah, uh, okay, so now it makes sense. Ah, uh, the Leshen. Okay, this makes more sense now. I'm now 100%. And saying if this man is honest, because you should always do that with Faye. Let's do it with Faye. Okay. Very well. More assistance is always useful. Well, we were just dealing with this issue here. These uh, kind of plants are an issue for any travelers. See that? You guys are quite strong. Well, some of us. No one there's sitting down, just like <laughs> bleeding and all torn up. So, some of us are very unlucky, but yes. looks over at in other ways. Yeah, sitting down, bleeding. He'll heal, He'll give you a nice scar or two. I, I feel like these ones don't care too much about scars. Yeah. Yes, um, we should, uh, yes, if we're going to head out, we should probably, uh, we have some allies with us uh, over there. They are people from their lands. Uh, they opposed them and assisted us. Oh my God, where are the bodies going? Yeah, and oh my God. I'm just going to. Back up, I'm just going to touch your arm whilst you're napping. Uh, we need to go and heal you at the same time. Oh, what the hell? Five more days. We don't have time. <laughs> you, can, you, can, you can sleep on the horse. Okay. If I, oh, strap, if I strap you to the horse. <laughs> 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 Quick, show them it's Space Invaders. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright, watch out. They're gonna start sucking you up, and then they're gonna fly away. Uh, uh, Backer, I heal you for 18. <sighs> Just so you don't get fucking killed whilst we're walking. Just, I, heal you. I healed you for 18. What the fuck is this thing? How much? 18. 18. Do you want to come back to I know numbers. No, I don't. I'm lying. Oh god, what is this? To the person that I don't know the name of yet, uh, is there anything you would like us to call you? You can call me Kane. <laughs> oh god, it's taking me! Uh. Oh no! <laughs> Save him! Oh my god! <laughs> no, <laughs> hey, Juice, these used to it. It's fine. And now you become part of it. <laughs> it's a ranger, he's just scouting out. It's fine. Subconsciously being part of the beast. 
<laughs> so yeah, we head out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, I kind of zoned out, like, for a hot minute, so... What, you? You never do that. I've been zoned out this whole time. <laughs> I've been zoned out this whole time. I've literally been watching YouTube or reading. Uh, that's, that's one of the things I gotta oh, You also have been in the game for, like, two, three hours, so, you know. Yeah. That'll do it. <laughs> yeah, so, we, yeah, she can keep traveling, you know? It'd be great, let's go. Yeah. Where are we heading off to? Uh, to a town with a cleric, hopefully. Uh, we should be able to get some words out of them. Uh, the of allies. Uh, we have a prisoner. Uh, we want to get information from him, because uh, then these a the prisoner. allies we are. Yes, we have an ally. The allies we are with wish to. They uh, they were hired by a church. So we need to get evidence so they can make and prosecute prosecute the church oh, prosecute. back in their homeland. They can do that as well. <laughs> Fucking church, who cares? Hmm. The church. They they were hired, you see. They were mercenaries, so No um, one's attacked my lord's kin. Yes, so uh, they they were hired. It's that's one of those things, so uh, Mercenaries are always an issue, but it's really, it's not their fault in a way, they're just getting paid. I would deal with the main issue as it were. Interesting. Not suspicious. Having, having, a, having a long grass for Oh yes. Yeah, you could do that. <laughs> Uh, there's there's still a cart, right? Or like a wagon? Well, there yeah. is a single cart. Well, yeah, pretty, much every, every, pretty much everyone has a horse. Minus me. <laughs> can't, yeah. can't, really, can't really ride a horse when you're sleeping. Uh, you can, you strap yourself to the horse. Uh, there is... <laughs> I'm not even joking, you strap yourself to a horse and you tie your horse to someone else and then they, you just follow. Yeah. Uh, exactly. I do that then. It's a fairly common thing they would do. Technically, there is two wagons. Uh, one wagon is Jones, the other one is uh, uh, Ladger. So you could haul yeah. all of his boys in one go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, true. Oh, yeah, so you could just swap with one of them so you could take a. And I would say short rest. You don't need a long rest every single time you get hurt, Gag. Okay? So, no. missing the prisoner just long rest. <laughs> no, you don't need a long rest. Yeah, you only do kidding. one a day. I'm one kidding. A day. What <laughs> so I'm assuming the prisoner is sitting in one of the two wagons. Uh, he is sitting yes, he would in be. one that is surrounded by a uh, well-armed Aladrin. Hmm. Okay, I'd sit down in that wagon as well. There is no room. Oh, some bitch. I mean, you could. You can share my horse if you wish. Yeah. I'll take a long rest on the ride. Or short rest, sorry. Well, don't, I don't want to get uh, Kurt all riled up. Uh, in the sense... We're gonna, the, take, the a, we're gonna we... take a long rest anyway. Yeah. yeah. The day thing is, end. you can take a long rest if you want, but then you can't later. And a short rest. In the sense, the day still would be ending soon. It's just, does anyone want to RP anything? Do anything? Uh, uh, I would like to have a word with someone. Ah, oh, really? He would? I would as well. Oh! So many people. Uh, alright. Who wants to talk first to who? Who wants to go first? Well, first, while walking over to the horse, if I pass that carriage with a prisoner, I would be twirling a certain dagger in my hand that the prisoner may or may not recognize. Really, everyone but the prisoner in that cart recognizes that dagger. <laughs> They're mercenaries. They're highlands. They don't uh, know anything. I mean, because every single person here either worships a fey lord, works with the fey, or is fey. <laughs> so okay. <laughs> now to sit there twirling my dagger. Yeah, people will just turn to you and be like, "Ah, huh. bring him back." back oh, you work for him. him. Uh... <laughs> I know a guy, Jerry. Jerry, he works for him too. Good for you, buddy. 
Kind of an asshole. <laughs> kind of an asshole. He's a bit snarly. You know, outside of that. He keeps attacking people randomly. It's really weird. <laughs> Says I'm worthy game. I think he's coming on. <laughs> I'm happy. Yeah. Oh, like oh. Uh, oh. Uh, Kurt, if you want to go ahead first, you can. Uh, well, mine would be during the long rest. In private. Mine would be as well. Okay. Uh, Kurt. Then I will. I'm gonna pull during a part aside. I that, think we need to talk. All right. So that this talk would be will be private, as in a secret chat uh, later on. Okay. Okay. Very well. And mine would be. Mine would be hopefully while I'm asleep, I can somehow manage to talk to Laura the Hunt. I wouldn't be able to talk oh, okay. to him, but someone else or someone of high power. Uh, you, want to, you want to talk to one of his little boys? I can summon one. Uh, you know who you could talk to. <laughs> you don't have any connection to anyone of worth, except yeah. for that one that you yes, have a connection to. It could be the okay, yeah. that could do that stuff. I'll talk to that. Alright. You get to know it a little bit more. Just roll a persuasion. Just a rough persuasion check. <sighs> persuasion. Uh. I feel like a phantom rogue would be good for the wild hunt. Phantom rogue would hmm. be great for the wild hunt, actually. Yeah, would have been a great choice, you know? It would be willing to speak with you. And you were cutting the whole time. Oh, dare you summon me? Bitch. <clears throat> so, Kane, do you want to have this conversation in a, a more secretive manner, or do you want it to have it open? Uh, probably more secretive. Alright, so two chats outside of session. <laughs> yes. Right. Gotta love secrets. <laughs> oh, so, yeah. Uh, tiefling person would have um, at some point introduced herself as Iru so. to the new person. Can because it's Belik, so he's invading people's personal space. And more lies the mom. That's gonna be fun. Talk with the 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 cool Eldrin guys. Eldrins? Can you? I, I don't know who Eldrins are, but I know who Eladrins are. Eladrins, Eldrins, Eldrins. Um, K- Korean. No, they sadly, they can't Alibaba. show you the word. Shit. But they can show you the Feywa. A different world, but not the world. Same shapes, different colors. Have you guys been able to get any information out of the prisoner at all? That's why we're going to... I've tried several times, but... That's why we're going to see a cleric, because they have uh, ways to make them say the truth. Hmm. Would you like if I try? I don't think he's going to talk um, unless we do this. We've tried many things. Are you going to harm him in any way? No, I'm not going to touch him. Very well. I mean, you're certainly welcome to try. I'm guessing we're at, we made camp by now. Oh, yeah. Likely this would be a camp if you would choose to do it. Mm-hmm. Because if so, then I'll just walk over to where the people <laughs> is, sit down across from them. There would be about... Four guards on him at all times. Because the Aladdin yeah. don't want to get gone. Yeah, one more. I said I wasn't going to touch him. No, yeah, okay. But it's still just that's how many guards are with him. Yeah. 
I sit down and say hello and Sylvan. Look up at you. I don't say anything. And Sylvan. Yeah. <laughs> he just stares. He stares and Sylvan. Good old Sylvan sass, you know. Mm. Can I ask, why did you take that job? Get you. Funny. Hmm. How much money? Enough. And what would be enough for you? Just a strange look. Question, does any of the guards or anyone else around seem to understand what I'm saying? All of them. Because they're a match. All. Okay. That changes things, then. Yep. Pretty much everyone here speaks Sylvan. Except for Sage, the one with yep. command. <laughs> That is fucking hilarious. That is actually amazing. Well, suge suggestion. I have a suggestion, which is better than command, but doesn't help that much because he keeps fucking resisting it. Yep. Every time. You know, one way or another, they're gonna get the information they want from you. You realize that, right? We'll stay quiet. And once they get what they want, you're more than likely going to end up dead. So why don't you make it easier on yourself and talk, and potentially you'll still live. See, this guy gets it. You don't threaten him with death. Look at fucking dummies. You don't threaten him with death or feeding him with what? I didn't threaten him with death. You did the. Literally had one of his friends oh, yeah, scratching away. More. That's not friend with death. You literally told him that I might speak to us and die, or you will die. Yeah, I don't remember. That's an interesting time. Do you have your vibrator on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a thing on low. I was wondering what that sound was. So no response to nothing from him? Nothing. Hmm. Is it nighttime? It is. Okay. Uh give me one second. One. Wow. I just sit there staring at him. After a while, just sitting there staring at him, I get up, walk away. Alright. Also, DM, do I, like, sense or know anything about the people around me? Uh, none of them are. Okay. Uh, no though, flat though looking at them, they all are all. They all are summer Eladrin or high elves or wood elves. Okay. Uh, the guy himself, if I remember correctly, he would have a.
No. None of them do. Okay. Day or night would pass if anyone else to do something. I wanted to talk with the the guys that I can't pronounce the thing of. The Eladrin. Mm hmm All right. Cramped. What you say? I. <laughs> Which one are you approaching? Just one random one or the head boy? What? Head boss dude. Head boss dude. Right. Uh, Galrath will look at you and hello. Uh, Boko, if I remember. Hmm? Okay. Uh, yeah, Boko. Sorry. Boko. Boko. Okay. How can I help you? I was just, you know, wondering about stuff. Because I haven't exactly been out of the Fae world much. And you seem like you know stuff more than I do. Uh, I work in between the Fae world and the material. So. Continuously, or <laughs> you get used to it. Uh, do you want to know anything? Yes, please. What do you want to know? So, right, first thing. Like, what? How are they cool with the name things? The name thing? Yeah, like. Oh, true, how... true names. Yeah, how do they just, oh. just well, give that stuff away like it's shiny things? Well, the <laughs> true name and names are two very different things. Um, uh, in the sense my name is Galvreth, that is my name I was given whenever I was born. Uh, though my true name is unknown to me. Uh, it is the name that my soul has the name that was given to me by existence. Uh, we do not know those names. Uh, huh. uh, uh, unless you know yours, which is very unlikely, uh, only a few beings actually do know their names. That being fiends uh, or angels. They normally know them. Uh, know their own, not know ours. Oh, okay. I was a bit worried. <laughs> yes. Um, the Fey are a bit similar in the fact, but a bit iffy. Uh, not all Fey know their true names. Uh, only a rare few do. So the name that you were given, uh, if that is Bucko, uh, then mm. that is not your true name. Mm. Unless by rare circumstance and happenstance. Um, oh, I see. So it is very unlikely. Hmm. Wow. That's the big info on names. Okay, second question. Why does everyone say it look weird? Uh, dragonborn on the material plane normally resemble uh, the chromatic or metallic uh, brands of dragon. <clears throat> uh, you are an oddity, a rarity in the uh, dragonborn nature. <laughs> Yay. That means I'm more shiny. Right? Yes. Yes. Hmm. Third thing. There's more <laughs> things. Uh, yes, there's many things. 
Why? Why are the horses so fast? <laughs> Why are horses so fast? Um, they, only have, they only have two legs more than me. Maybe well, it's Maybelline. Uh, <laughs> you put the lotion on the skin. Um, <laughs> they have two more legs. They move twice as fast as you. Actually, don't, don't. that's good logic right there. <laughs> they do it. <laughs> I think our movement speed is 40, though, so... Uh, nah, I don't know. The reason why they move faster is because they were bred to move faster. Uh, horses are just... ...faster. They were made that like that by nature. Oh, okay. So they're not secretly... ...dragons. No. <laughs> Unless a dragon is hiding their true form as a horse. Then Which they do do. <laughs> they could do. And make half horse dragons. They could do it. But. Oh, God to. It's just a very kinky dragon. I see. I like the Zeus of all dragons. But, uh, they're just fast because Mother Nature wanted it that way. Mother Nature's She is. How... How many Fey actually live outside the Fey Wilds? <laughs> that, that's whenever he just makes, like, exploding face. <laughs> like, oh. A lot. A lot? Uh, oh, yes. Uh, it, it especially depends on the country. Uh, here in Maranesh, or the continent, uh, there are a few. Uh, I don't know the exact number, but they number in well past the hundreds. Easily. Uh, though in my, my homeland, Sli, uh, thousands upon thousands. Easily. <laughs> it is... Uh, the the link to this world. Wow. That's so cool. Okay, okay. One more thing. Um is Okay, out of character, does Fae World have currency? Yes, the Feywild does have currency, though it mainly is like favor for a favor, uh, though depending on what cities or you go to, it could be actual gold, silver. So currency is a thing in the Fey. It's just depending on what you're dealing with, favors or money. Right. So it's completely up in the air on the who you deal with. Okay, so let's say you um, fey dragon and shit. Do they deal with favors, money, or trinkets? Uh, fairy dragons normally don't deal with anything. They normally just take what they want and they leave <laughs> uh, as fast as possible. Outside of that, they normally deal in trinkets. They the the more shiny things. They're still dragons in nature. Uh, though warped by the Feywild, uh, they still like that shiny. Oh, yes. They're more like kobolds, but actually right. a dragon. Right. Boko is very confused by the concept of money, then. <laughs> Even though they know that, that she exists, they just know that they have a shit ton of shiny things that they took with them out of the Feywild. Okay, so one more thing. How do I get trinkets? Well, you can... There's a few things. You can trade okay. for them. You can use what money you have uh, to trade for random items that you come across. They're normally mm -hmm. knick-knack shops in some cities. But you can just find some random oddities. <laughs> Or you can 
Well, to just find them. Around. Um. But mainly buy them. Right, right, right. Then, after you just saying shinies, it's just gonna... Do you know what... You know money, yes? Are you fresh out of the fae? Uh... I, I remembered someone was going on about having two of them. Two, two gold shiny things. But yeah, I never left the fate world before. But all I know is that some shinies are more shiny than others. Which that doesn't make sense. Alright. He's going to pull out a stick, as in he picks up one from the ground, finds a nice open dirt spot, and he's going to teach you about money. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, God. Uh, and he's not the best lecturer, so he summons a fairy, <laughs> which is better than him. And, okay, uh, so this is uh, basic economics. So. Literally, the fairy is going to teach you basic economics. Uh, just how money works. <laughs> in the All kinds world. of basic economics class. <laughs> I'll Econom be your teacher. Economics one. And, At yeah, some point, you just hear a holy shit into <laughs> some of the thing. Yeah, you have a lot of sh money on you. So. I did not know I had this much. Relatively richer than most people will be in their entire life. <laughs> I am true. <laughs> so, to be truthful, I have met a single dragon in my life. I will be blunt. They have a lot more <laughs> than you do. Most dragons do. Because they live to collect. Though, don't be shying away from that, for you can also live to collect. I shall live, co live to collect for all fairy dragon kind. <laughs> now that's the spirit. <laughs> My ideal is to collect for the entire thing. <laughs> no idea what's going on. Yes. Good. <laughs> How long are you gonna go? Keep going? So? I'm gonna get the camera and then we're gonna. Okay. I shall be the shiniest collector of them all. Thank you for this talk. This has been very enlightening. I'm happy to help. I, I can't see. I'm so cool. <laughs> Galrath has done his good boy points today. Done. Um. <laughs> Taught, he's taught someone how to money. Holy shit. That took probably close to two hours. <laughs> money is very difficult. He says there's a second class if you want it, and it goes in the savings and loans. Absolutely. Uh, so. <laughs> Alright. Well, the next day, <laughs> loans. <laughs> you have learned about. And how not to deal with it. Just don't. <laughs> Just stop. <laughs> they're a bad idea. What? Nah, they're great. What are you talking about? Unless you're the one loading. And make sure people pay it back. I see. I shall be the loan shop. <laughs> now there you go. That's how you get more shinies. <laughs> don't you mean the lone dragon? Holy shit, you write a lone dragon? <laughs> Holy shit, I'm gonna be a lone dragon. That's my goal. That's kinda of lonely. Nah, I won't be lonely with all my gold. Ah, uh, the true <laughs> dragon. <laughs> uh, 
the second day would pass uh, with nothing more or less happening. Uh, does anyone do anything on that day? Craft. Besides the second class of economics. And anyone's welcome. <laughs> Craft him. You know what? I'm gonna advertise this and say it's one gold <laughs> to enter. <laughs> oh, she's learning. But you would you would learn that on the third class, though you wouldn't have learned on the second one. So you'd learn yeah. about it on the second class. That is I true. learned the basics of money on the first one, which means basically I give thing and I get thing. Right. Give entrance to class, get money. So the fate would teach you, but I would receive that payment, not you. <laughs> yep. No. Because <laughs> they're the one actually teaching. <laughs> And that's why they teach you how basic learning works and basic economics. On the third day, what would they teach? Fuck. About credit cards, don't you get don't get one? Credit cards don't exist in this world. <laughs> credit cards. About business? Oh uh, yeah, they would probably teach you about like rough business practices. So like in the sense, yeah, where you were trying to get admission, you would try to negotiate. I'd get the majority, and you'd get a small portion. And yeah, you buy, buy low, sell high. Yeah, <laughs> whatever stocks come in. That's class four, but sadly you get to. The well, that's just camera. basic trade. It's not stocks. It's basic trade. No, 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 stocks. The face stocks. Face stocks. It exists. Uh, I wonder who actually. Let me double check. Which Fey Lord would probably deal in stocks? Which one's the insane one again? Uh, the yeah. Pooh. Honey. No. Honey. He, he wouldn't deal in. Would not deal in face stocks. <laughs> uh, it'd probably be the Moonlit King. He serves the Winter Court. And of all people, he'd deal in stocks because he's crazy. <laughs> More of a newfangled invention he thought up. But, See what I must do. But he's also batshit insane. Because he got rejected one too many times. <laughs> Loser. Yeah. Poor Maybe guy. he should just not get rejected. Yeah. Well, he should really get things. He should stop trying to you know, get with his wife. Or his ex wife. He should really move on. Because he's down. insane. He's down bad. This is so fucking sad. But I like to play the stocks. <laughs> Damn. I don't even get to the stocks part of the class because he was saying something something about it. This is so sad. Okay. And third day. Reach camera. Um, third day also. That will happen. Craft. I agree, dog. Bark. Does that mean at some point we get max hit points? Yes. Because yeah, we would have a long rest in between each day. Everyone will be on full. Sweet. Down. And as you all reach the mountain city of Kamra, uh, it would more or less be a massive opening in uh, the mountain whenever you reach there. So 
As you notice the long tunneling, uh, and throughout the tunnel itself, uh, built in to the stonework, uh, more or less arrow holes lining this long, long stretch as you see pretty easily guards inside uh, as you hear them talking as you're not the only people here also uh my brain's going too much uh there would be other carts trying to enter camera or <coughs> ido uh along with a multitude of guards that are we're just going through speaking to everyone checking cargo uh seeing the massiveness of your caravan now uh, and one dwarven guard approaches looking at all of you uh who would be in the lead I'd probably be skimming ahead out of sheer excitement because, ooh, new shit! So you would not be with the main group? I don't think so. Okay, so they would not approach you. Because you would just be a strange person. <laughs> no, no one talks so weird, though. They will. It'll just be uh, the large group of people takes part. So we're the one. Hmm. I will then, because no one else will. Okay. Uh, and the dwarf will look up at you all and. Uh, what brings you to Karma? Uh, visiting. For how long? Okay, my cat. Uh, fucking. Chat, Joan. A day or two, not too long. Oh yes, uh, we also wish to speak to a cleric. If uh, we had this one in the city. Uh, okay. uh, a bit farther in to the city, you will find a temple to the crafted flame. They'll probably help you. Okay, thank you. Uh, do you mind if we look through the cargo? Make sure you're not carrying anything bad. No, uh, we do have a prisoner. Turn his head to you. Oh. A uh, mercenary who was attacking Faye for being Faye. Right. And why is. Uh... E coming in in chains. Uh, we need to get information out of him, so we wish to seek the cleric to get the truth out of them. So check you. Let us see if he can take you out. For some reason, he doesn't trust you. It's not that. Bring us All right, I'll have some guardsmen take you to him then, just in case. That would that'll be uh, very useful. Thank you. And uh, you hear Joan would uh, actually ask the guardsmen. Uh, 
Joan would ask the guardsman about uh, if a Mel uh, Melman stern shield is still in the uh, craft uh, craftsman district, uh, and he would very much say yes. Uh, still crafting some of the best weapons we can make. She'll nod her head. And she will just hit the wall and be all good to go. I look to the guard. Alright. He'll wave his hand to you. Or to two people. And just yeah. order them to stick with you all to get to the temple. So we'll try and find a lodging first so we all know where to meet up. The guards will nod their head. And uh, one of the guards will ask, Do you want us to show you a good place or. <laughs> we know of you. Well, uh, Charlie, you can decide. <laughs> City sheet. I kind of did that. I don't care either way. Yeah. <coughs> as long as it's got stone floors, I don't care. Which I'm assuming most buildings do in this place. Uh, for some reason, uh, you can assume yes. Don't know why. I'm pretty sure I do. No, it's uh, built in a mountain, so. Uh, uh, Joan would ask if the Ale Princess is still open. The guards would say yes. She would ask for them to take us there. Perfect. Uh, the party makes their way into the city of Kamra. Kamra! To end the session. So people can... So it has been three days. Uh, could you... Could I? Uh, I don't know if you want to do this, but... I'd like to track the days on the quest. Ah ha ha, I actually have the numbers starting to be out already. Yeah, no, but on the actual quest in the uh, chat. Nice. Also, Ren, give me like 10, 15 minutes before the private meeting. Yeah, yeah, we could, yeah, we'd be doing all those probably. Yeah, it'll be in a bit, I have to eat, because <laughs> I'm fucking hungry. Okay, oh. just message me. Does anyone have any anything they need before things be happening? Before the game ends. Yeah, before game done. I think so. I'm a skid at Lugo. Alrighty. So use of fun. Yeah. Adios. Bye. Peace. Bye. I get on out of here, but not before the session ended. <laughs>